Hello. Hello, hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, usually I wait until the ad is over so we can get rid of pre-rolls, but now I was actually a little bit late. Uh, <laughs> but hey, how you doing? How you doing, guys? Tattooed Bart is today's first. Palm is today's second. And Choco is today's third. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. And uh, Palm got to cook. Let him cook, guys. What is he cooking, though? What is he cooking today? Um, and Shady, how you doing? How you doing? How am I? I'm doing pretty good. Uh, I'm kind of tired, though. I won't lie. <laughs> uh, I I went to, well. I did go to bed a little bit later than usual, but at the same time, I also. Hello, uh, uh, <laughs> hello again. <laughs> Hello, clever. Hello. Um, but at the same time, I also got woken up too many times because of my stupid neighbors. Yeah, so the neighbors that live upstairs, they have been gone for like maybe two months. I have no idea what happened. And, um, and this week they came back and it was noticeable. Let's just say that because they are the loudest neighbors that I've ever had in my entire life. So, um, yeah, and they do not have a degen sleep schedule, uh, at least not to the same extent as I do. <laughs> so I, I am, I'm a little tired today. <laughs> uh, you love my necklace. Thank you. I love it too. It's, um, it has like, it's, it's a glass, uh, thing with, with some moss in it. Um, that, there's actually a funny story with this one because it used to look even better. Um, but I, there was something, uh, <laughs> it was a summer, uh, some, some years ago where I, I had a, a midnight bath, uh, with all my clothes on <laughs> and I had this one on and it kind of just ruined the, the metal on the necklace and uh, I had to wait for such a long time until the, the moss in, in there got um, dry. <laughs> uh, that's so not fun to deal with. It is not fun to deal with at all. I am so tired of having neighbors and they all, the audacity of them all because they take up so much space and they even take up space that is supposed to be my space and they don't ask me any, anyway. And I'm just, my problem is that I used to be a lot more shy of conflict than I am now, but now it's more like I don't have the energy for it. I'm not shy of conflict, but I'm I'm like, <sighs> I need to prepare myself mentally to do it and f physically because it's just, I just don't have the energy to uh, make people hate me <laughs> because that's what's going to happen. So I'm like, uh, maybe I should just suffer in silence instead, because, I mean, I don't know. Yeah. You're so tired, Orion. Did you not sleep? Did you not sleep? Loud neighbor sucks. You know the feeling. Yeah. And today, some other neighbors, uh, that, that doesn't really bother me, though, because they don't, it's not something they do. They just didn't inform uh, people in the neighborhood. But they have like a huge pavilion outside uh, on their lawn. So they're having like a huge party or something. I don't know. Um, but I think they're quiet now, though. I think they got quiet right before I started streaming. But that didn't actually bother me, though, because it's like they, they, they're not usually loud or anything. Um, but it's just when everyone around you are loud, it gets tiring. <laughs> Uh, and when it's the same people too, yeah. Neighbors is not fun. I, I don't like having neighbors. <laughs> uh, it's lovely and hope you have a fun stream. You'll be lurking. Just got uh, your lunch. Got to eat. Mm. Okay, okay. Yeah, you got you got to eat. You got to eat. But thank you so much. And thank you so much for the lurk as well. You managed to get to sleep fairly soon after the stream. 
Uh, you were so tired, but you woke up at nine to go to the bathroom because your stomach wasn't... Oh, I'm so sorry, Ryan. That is... That is... That is such a long time. But take, take some time to rest today. Take all the time you need to rest today. When you studied, you had the loudest neighbors. Like, the lady walked in there with heels or something constantly. And they were arguing a lot. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That, that hasn't been the issue with the ones upstairs. But they've been, like... They stomp around a lot. Like, they... They, they don't walk like normal people do. They just stomp around, both of them, because they're like a couple. And then they slam the doors and they play, play loud music before noon. Um, and... They also have a dog that keeps yapping all the time. Um, I don't know, there's just a bunch of stuff. Um, <laughs> and... They have had some really loud fights as well, where they've also slammed the doors. So, you know, it's a, it's a whole thing. It's a whole thing. <laughs> uh, you did sleep, but it was just very little, and you're just now feeling... Oh, maybe you should have taken a nap, but you were playing Elden yourself. Hmm. Well, I do hope that you get more rest tonight. Okay? Um, pretty sure it was the pizza. The cheese. Wait, are you lactose intolerant, Orion? But today has already passed. Mm. Typical neighbors. Yeah. Yeah. I wish that I could... You know, my dream is to have my own little house in in a forest or something. Well, but at the same time be be within uh, like walking distance of, of like a... Either everything that I need or just a fairly regular bus, you know? One of the two, but I just want to be in peace. <laughs> I want to be left in peace <laughs> and have quiet around me. Um, I want to be, you know what, I've, I've said this for many years already. I want to be that type of old lady that people mistake for a witch that just lives in a cottage in the woods and then people are scared of walking past or like if they do walk past it for some reason, there's always like this, this, uh, rumor that I'm a witch or something, you know? Just just that type of person. That's that's what I want. <laughs> that's what I want for me. <laughs> uh, the place where you got the pizza, you're pretty sure the cheese is not lactose free, but you Oh, I see, I see. Oh, um, so you do you are lactose intolerant then. Mm. Yeah, I've had pizza there a few times without cheese already. Mm. You've had such peace of your mind since you bought your own house. I can imagine. I want that too. <laughs> I just don't have the money to, to, or finances at all, to buy my own place. Not even close. Uh, so I, I would love that though, but I, I can't. Maybe if I win the lottery, even though I'm not even, <laughs> not participating in any lotteries either. So I can't even say that. Mm. You don't th know if you are, but you think you might be. Mm. You wish you could do an official test, but they don't really do those because... Wait, because... because of what? I mean, what what I was told when I... When I first... well, not first, but... After a while, after I had... Started getting my migraines... Very regularly, I was told by, well, my mom went to a, a doctor's office where they, where they took those tests and stuff. Um, it wasn't just a regular doctor's office either. I don't remember what it was, but one of the people working there, she told me that the smartest thing to do, because these tests are really expensive, uh, is to just try to eliminate uh, one type of food for like a month or two and see if it affects your uh, well, whatever's uh, wrong with you, I guess. Oh, do you hear that? That's Those are bats. There are bats flying around outside. Um, <laughs> uh, 
Um, so to just not eat anything with that um, in your diet for at least a month or two and see. Because it's a lot cheaper, you know? And that's what I did with milk because I, I thought maybe... I was told maybe it could be either because of gluten or, or well, lactose. So I tried to... I tried to avoid anything with those two things. It didn't change anything though, so that wasn't the issue. But that's when I started drinking plant-based uh, milk. Drinking. I mean, well, I mean, I had it in food too. But <laughs> and that's when I learned that, you know, I actually like this much better. And I never, I've never bought a carton of milk ever since then. And this was maybe 11 years ago now i think i think cow's milk is disgusting now <laughs> just the idea of it and i'm not a vegan and i'm not a vegetarian either but i just think it's disgusting that's just my opinion on it but you know so so it's it's not all bad sometimes you learn that you, well sometimes you find alternatives that you end up liking better too um You've seen memes about that and you love it? Hmm. <laughs> Wait, about what? You don't know English words, but issues can be like in inside the body more when... Oh, oh yeah, I see. Uh, you mean like comor co comorbidity or something? If you have some because you also had stomach issues when you have been drinking juice, like it used to not be an issue. Hmm. But what is the... I mean, I've heard that some things can be more of a struggle, but I don't know the reason why. Other than... That's just how it is. But I don't know, like, the reason behind it. I need to tell Palm that you got... Probably in between... <laughs> Does that mean juice? Because I, I thought, uh, I mean, I saw you guys were talking about it yesterday, but then I was like, eh, I don't understand. Like, yeah, they can just talk among themselves. <laughs> uh, dairy milk is just so icky. I, I agree. I agree. It's, it's gross. But I do like cheese, though, and that is also made with milk, so it's like, but it's just... <laughs> I wish there was good vegan cheese, but there isn't. One that tastes good and also melts really well and it's also affordable because that is also an issue because it's usually not affordable you stopped drinking it when you were like 13 or 14 and your family was in a tizzy about you drinking soy instead yeah yeah that was the issue with my family as well because i used to be a vegetarian for a while i mean it wasn't a long time it was like maybe a year and a half or something but they they thought I was so difficult. I was being so difficult. So they stopped inviting me to stuff. Or it was like, can you even be here to eat and stuff because of this and that? And, you know, they were just... They had issues with it. But I didn't expect anyone to accommodate me either. You know? So I don't know why they were being like that. I guess it's just... You know, th that was my main issue with... Uh, well... One of the main issues with being a vegetarian in, in a family that doesn't, you know, respect it at all. <laughs> they just see, see it as a problem. Um, but yeah, I, I, it was, it was also because it was just so overwhelming because at the time there weren't a lot of, um, substitutes, I guess. So I had to make so much stuff from scratch and I have never liked cooking and it just it became an obsession because I always had to think about food and it just wasn't good for me mentally in, in the end. So I I started uh, I started eating more fish and stuff and just to make it a little bit easier and then some chicken and now I like that's mainly what I have now uh, when it comes to um, 
meat, I guess. It takes a shot of whiskey. <laughs> hey, Toonie. How you doing? Oh, oh, it's cheese. I see, I see, I see. Milk is everywhere here, it feels like. Mm. Yeah. And, and, uh... Plant-based uh, dairy products, which is non-dairy products, but you know what I mean. Dairy substitutes, I guess, um, are usually also really expensive. At least here. Oh, about neighbors thinking you might be a witch. Oh, wait, I I don't know about that meme, but I I, I just been it's just been a thought that I've had <laughs> my entire life. <laughs> I just want that for me. Um. When you really start thinking about it, dairy is kind of disgusting. It is. It is. Hey, da, 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 Darwin? How you doing? <laughs> Hi, I know again. Welcome in, welcome in. I take it you you might mean Norwegian, Nor 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 as one of my mods would say. Norwegian. You used to drink milk a lot daily, but when you moved to by yourself at some point, you didn't drink it as much anymore, so that could also be... Uh, mm. Maybe, but it, it shouldn't really, I don't know. I don't know. It really is. You still eat cheese, but you have not, uh, to not think that, uh, that much about it. Mm. That's how it is for me as well. I don't really think about it too much, but I do eat cheese. Um, I wouldn't say a lot of cheese though, but I do, I do have it. You found a really nice vegan cheese in your local grocery store. Don't know if it melts well, but it tastes good. Mm, but you only purchased it because it was on sale. Yeah, that's that's how I usually end up buying it too, because it's close to its expiration date or something like that. And then it gets, it gets cheaper. But yeah. You wish you could lay down and still type on your computer and also without falling asleep. I feel that. I feel that. Sometimes it would be nice to do that while streaming too. <laughs> Without it being weird. Uh, get a speech to text thing. Mm. I mean, that is... Does that work on Twitch though? Can, can you combine that with Twitch? You just wish you knew what happens for what reason, so it would be easier to adjust and maybe prevent also in some cases. Mm. But you want to speak that would lead to text with 90% filler words, so <laughs> Yeah, I guess I guess that's that's true. That's fair. Stream of consciousness chats with Orion. Mm. <laughs> what if you could just connect it to your thoughts so you would just type out your thoughts? That would be nice. Well, I mean maybe not. I mean you would probably have to moderate it a little bit before sending it, but you know. <laughs> It wouldn't it wouldn't be as efficient as you might think, I guess. You don't know if you're just too tired or too or too too fancy English words? Wait, what do you mean? Let's all just have a tadpole connection for easy transfer of thoughts. I already have that with a few other people. Um Like Chris, for example, we, we constantly tadpoled because we just we just have the same thoughts. <laughs> uh, Bob's that is for Orion. That is Orion's favorite command. It used to be at least. Maybe not anymore, but it used to be. <laughs> it used to be. <laughs> uh, I remember that day so well. Uh, when when that happened, and I was I was playing The Witcher. We were actually in. Uh, Tierna Leah. I know exactly where in the game we were when that <laughs> happened. And Ryan was... <laughs> and Ryan was so embarrassed. Uh... Oh, it's one of my other loud neighbors. That was one of the ones that I didn't mention earlier. Can you imagine that? Yeah. I have several. I'm, aren't I lucky? I'm, I'm, I'm so lucky. It's funny though, because... Maybe like half a year ago, a year ago. I had, it was really nice and quiet here, but then suddenly 
four, no, three new people moved in around the same time. And they were all loud and uh, selfish. <laughs> yes, I am salty about it. <laughs> I am so salty about it. Every day. Um, random thought, and this is going to sound wrong, but have you heard of Rod? I, I have indeed, but in what context are you talking about that now, Toonie? W wh why is that relevant in this context? <laughs> you think you're a loud neighbor at times? Wait, what are you doing, Orion? What are you, what are you doing? Are you metalhead? Okay, let us do the... 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 the redeem. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Hello! There we go. Wait, what? 20 months? <laughs> Metalhead, thank you so much! Wait! Oh, I just needed to make sure that it actually, you know... Uh, registered because I didn't have the 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 thing connected here to this scene and uh, that turned out to be a problem the first stream um, but thank you so much happy 20 months I'll be doing well have you been playing some Elden Ring 2 as well too as well <laughs> um, because I have not played the DLC this is what we're we're kind of leading up to the DLC by doing a new playthrough but making it a little bit more interesting. Uh, you think you've actually heard the term, but you're not sure what it means, especially when you say this might sound wrong. <laughs> well, I don't, I don't know. Um, I don't know if I should explain it. <laughs> uh, it isn't relevant, but it is in regards to flying. Wait, flying? Who are we talking about? Fl who? Who, who, who we're talking about flying? You scream and yell at times when you're overwhelmed or something, like today when you were playing Elden Ring. Oh, that's actually interesting, Orion, because I, <laughs> I do the same thing. <laughs> it's like, it's funny because I don't really, I'm not really a rage type of person when I game, especially not when I stream. But when I'm when I can when I'm not streaming and when I'm by myself and I think no one can hear me, I can I can be very loud. I can be very loud. Uh, and I was told that by one of my neighbors. Um, well, it was actually my landlady who said that one of the neighbors had told her. But she it, she said to me that it was only mentioning like as a. You know, as something funny, not as a complaint. So it was like, uh, was, was she asked me if it was because I was gaming or something. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I, I guess I can be a little bit loud if I, yeah. So I can, I don't really yell when I get overwhelmed as much, but I, well, I mean, I guess I can do that too, but I, I don't know. It's, it doesn't happen that often. I try not to, at least. What? Wait. What happened? <laughs> Dude, wait, why? Okay, we need we need to we need to start that one again. There we go. Thank you so much, Toonie, for gifting you some to Shady. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed the sub, and you guys started a hype train. Yeah, so for those who don't know, we are doing a weapon wheel spin for our Elden Ring playthrough, which means that I'm gonna, I'm gonna spin a wheel that has 159 weapons on it. And for each fifth sub, any type of sub, uh, I think it's actually sub points, not subs. So it's like any any type of sub and or sub points. 
or 1500 bits, I will do a wheel spin and uh, it will be a random weapon that I'm going to have to use for 20 minutes. So that is, uh, it's been a lot of fun so far, I have to say. So when we get into the game, I'm going to do a wheel spin. Actually, I can do a wheel spin before the game, but you know, that's what we can, what we're going to do. <laughs> but thank you so much. Orion Wolfia cheered. X three hundred and twenty three. Orion, thank you for the three hundred and twenty three bits. Gosh, dang it! Thank you so much. Uh, <laughs> uh, can you ask what make your pal uh, palette you using? Your iMac is so. I I just use either a uh, Mac shadows or I just use uh uh what are they called uh lime crime it's one of the two those are usually the only uh eyeshadows that I use but they're very uh, pigmented that that I, I I like that um but thank you I think one time you got called Someone called the police on you because the apartment you were living your chair used to be close to the heater thing and you think you kept bonking it with the chair and some neighbor thought it was too much. Wait, and they called the cops because of that? That's wild. You just swap between Norwegian dialects at random when you're home. <laughs> you know, I do that too sometimes or I just I just uh, try out like different accents in in English too. Um, I don't know. Sometimes I just, or I just make random sounds that don't make any sense. I'm so glad. I actually thought about this yesterday when I was, um, you know, after stream, I was just chopping a bunch of vegetables. No, fruits. Um, because I was making a fruit salad. And I was like, I'm so glad that no one actually knows who I truly am. <laughs> Orion? What? A tier two? For Toonie? Orion? Oh, it showed the wrong sub. Oh, the, the wrong alert. <laughs> Thank you so much. I hope you enjoy the sub, Toonie. Thank you. You might have yelled also then. Wait. Oh, that too. Oh, I see, I see. <laughs> you guys are too kind. While talking to yourself. I do that all the time. But yeah, I thought about that last night. I was like, I just started making random sounds. And I'm like, I'm so glad that no one has actually seen who I am. Like, when I'm 100% by myself. All alone. Because... I would be so awkward. <laughs> I would be... I would be so embarrassed and awkward if anyone saw what I was actually like when I'm by myself. Um, there's a trend apparently called raw dogging. You take a flight, especially a long international one. You don't do anything but watch the flight details. No snacks, no music or movies, no sleeping, just sitting and watching the flight details. But why? Why is that a trend? That sounds super boring. Who would want to do that? Well, I mean, is it does it have a purpose? Is it just to cure your, uh, you know, boredom? Or like you get used to being bored? Because people are so used to not being bored? Like, does it have an actual purpose? Wait, what is going on with my camera? There we go. You saw this on Insta Reels? That sounds interesting, but also like super boring. <laughs> Sometimes you're not sure, but you feel like yeah, you listen to music very loudly, but you're not sure how much it. Hmm. I see. Yeah, I. I'm very cautious about listening to music as well because I don't want people to hear my music. So I usually listen with my headphones, or. Yeah. Or I sit here, which I don't have anyone above me that can hear me at night. 
And I listen to music so no one can actually hear it. And I don't listen to it very loudly either. Um... I am catching up really slowly. And he was a fairy, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Indeed, that is actually very true with that one. You always like to watch makeup videos on YouTube, but your hooded eyes make it difficult. I have hooded eyes too. Orion Morphia Cheers. X three hundred and twenty three. What? What are you guys doing? What is this? Ryan, thank you for, again for the 323 bits and Toonie for gifting a sub to, to Angry Ostrich. Angry Ostrich, AK Cody, was who we raided yesterday, by the way. Thank you so much for gifting a sub. Um, thank you. You always liked it. Wait, um, but I also have hooded eyelids. I also have hooded eyelids. Well, I mean, you can probably tell. Um,. Actually, I don't know if you can tell, but I do. It's... Can we just not be loud right now? <laughs> I'm talking. <laughs> it was also late night or late evening time. Mm. Yeah, it did unfocus. Mm. You didn't invent it. People do dumb things. I mean, that's true. People do do dumb things, but I just... I wonder, like... Sometimes trends have a purpose. I just wonder if it has an actual purpose, you know? Is there an actual reason why people do it? Because it, it, they could be. I just can't see... See it. <laughs> uh, you had this... Let's keep our hands to ourselves, hmm? Yeah. <laughs> Right. <laughs> oh, thank you guys so much for the hype chain, guys. You, you're too kind. I got an emote. Wait, is that a... Is that a... Is that a... It's a bear. Batter up. Batter up. Thank you guys so much. You're too kind. You're too kind. But you've had this one vocal sim thing today. Mm, I... Yeah. Wait, also, wait, that was, wait, that reminds me. I, I had a song stuck in my head all day yesterday, and that was my vocal stem. <laughs> Just re repeating this one word from, from well, the, the title of the song, because it's said so many times. Have you guys heard the song? Um, it's, 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 I don't, I don't, I need to, I need to look this up. I, I, why do I feel awkward saying this now? Do you understand what it, what I'm? I know Orion knows what this is about without me actually saying anything because it's like now that I want to say it, I can't say it. I can't say it. You know, I'm just gonna post the song in the Discord. That's you know, that's a good solution. Hold on, let me let me find it. Um. Uh, that's a good solution. Um. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I just, I, I hate when that happens. It's like, I can't say it now, but I can post it. Yeah, I'm posting it in the music channel. <laughs> uh, is that also from Moonrise Place? Wait, this song? This one is from the Underdark. I think this is called The Colors of the Underdark or something. Um, it also has almost the same birthday as... Yeah, that's true. That is true. My raid story should be a thing. <laughs> I do have some raid stories, though. When people uh, raid in or out. Uh, well, I mean, when I raid out or people raid into my channel. So, you know, it does happen. If there is something to say, I will say it. <laughs> <laughs> we're 
Or is my toot toot message? You wish you knew why sometimes you get it and sometimes you don't, or most times. I think it has something to do with the level, the hype train level. I think because there are specific emotes to each level. So if you've unlocked all the level one uh, emotes, then you won't get any new ones. But if it's a different level, then you might not have gotten all of them. Uh, so I think that's it. But to claim a word that is already a completely different thing is kind of weird. Like, who, why raw dogging of all things? <sighs> People like to change the meaning of a lot of words, which really bothers me. Because, like, language doesn't have any meaning if you're just going to change the meaning all the time. And then, because the majority start using it the wrong way, then the whole word will have this new meaning instead, instead of the old original one. Even if it's just slang. It's like, it's like how people use the word uh, twink right now. It's like, you don't know the meaning of the word. You just think it's, it's a fun, quirky word to use about someone, you know, that you think is, you know, whatever. I don't know, but it doesn't, it doesn't fit people's description a lot of the time when people say it. And it bothers me so much. You don't get the emote alerts. You don't know if you ever get any. Hmm. Maybe you've just gotten all of them. <laughs> uh, last time you did get the raid train emote alert thing, but you haven't gotten one in so long. Two avocados for 10 bucks. <laughs> yeah, the starting bit alert. <laughs> hey, old crow, how you doing? It used to tell you if you had them all for that level. Yeah, I think, but I think I get them if I have gotten all of them. But maybe it doesn't happen all the time, which is kind of weird. Uh, sometimes it's nice when it changes, but when there's multiple meanings, it's, yeah. The name raw dogging is why you said it may sound wrong. That is already a thing. But I mean, people use raw dogging in like, not as the actual meaning too, but it's also like... I don't even know how to explain it when it's used in... I don't mean the in the in the sexual way, but I mean in like, let's say you're gaming and you're just jumping into something without planning or anything. That's when you call it raw dogging, you know? You know, kind of like if you if I do the weapon wheel spin and I just get a random weapon and I don't plan ahead or anything or level it up, I'm just raw dogging it. I'm just going straight into it, you know? <laughs> so that makes sense. But when people make up new meanings for word or they just make it fit their agenda. And yes, you can probably tell that it's because I'm very triggered when people call a star in a twink because he is not. He doesn't fit the description. And it really bothers me. And everyone calls him that. Everyone. Okay, maybe not everyone, but a lot of people do it. When it's not true. And some people even talk... They, some people have even said that uh, Link... They, they call him an elf twink. They're like, no, he's not. What is wrong with you? Can you stop... Twisting things to be, like, to, to fit your agenda just because you want it to be true doesn't mean that it is. You know? Um, because you used to, to get the message, but you didn't get any new emotes. Mm. You've not been a part of many hype trains since the new emotes came out. You should not have them all. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It's weird. Of course, there is sexual meaning to it as well. I mean, the first, the, the original one is a sexual meaning. It hasn't been turned into something sexual afterwards, which is usually the case. But in this case, I think it was a sexual term first, and then it's been used in different uh, contexts, uh, like afterwards. Definitely get it when spelling eventually changes to make it more modern. Mm. No one is a twink in Baldur's Gate 3. Yeah, yeah, they, they're not. 
they are not. Um, and it doesn't. It's not just because of the sexuality, but it's also like the meaning. Like, so for those who don't know, the actual meaning is a twink is like a a gay man that is um like very very small or skinny uh or you know just just petite and skinny person that is also gay but he's also not skinny or short or any any of those things None of those things. And and he's also not gay, so I don't understand. I don't get it. Everyone in Baldur's Gate 3 is canonically pansexual. They've even said that. That is accurate in D&D &D as well. Everyone is pansexual unless it's stated otherwise. You know, if anyone is said to be... Like, said to have a specific, specific sexual orientation... They're all pansexual. Everyone. Every single one. And uh, that's that's just how it is. That's just how it is. And I, the, it bothers me because I am... It annoys me when people try to erase, you know, bi or pan sexual people in, in media or in games or movies or whatever. Because, like, it's not, like, it's not black and white. No one is just... It's not like everyone is either gay or straight. Some of them are in between. You know? What if you're a cansexual or you don't want to see it with a can of coke? <laughs> hey, if that is if that is what you identify as, uh, Toonie, then who am I to say? <laughs> also the abs, exactly. Exactly. Yeah, the the from what my understanding at least, and I think that is true because I've also like I've also tried to Google it to make sure that it's like, okay, I had the right understanding and I did. And it literally says Let me just you know, I can actually Google it right now, just so I know word for word what it says. Okay? Um Okay, yeah, so what it says... Twink is a gay slang for a man who is usually, but not always, in his late teens to twenties, whose traits may include a slim to average physique. A youthful... Wait, I, I, I can't finish reading that. Yeah, a young, attractive gay man with a slim, boyish appearance. Or, another one, it refers to a stereotype of thin, hairless, young gay men who are often white, though not always. So, none of it fits, yet everyone calls him that. And it bothers me so much, because it's not even accurate on any level, it's just because it's suddenly so popular to use the word now. So that people don't even use it correctly because it's just they just want an excuse to use a word that is currently popular to use but even people saying it about link it doesn't even fit because you know he's not gay sure he might be uh, he might be small and he's supposed to be like in his late teens or something as well i mean i guess it depends on the game too uh like which version of the game but in, in most cases, he has, like, a relationship with Zelda, right? Mm, you get it when people view, certain, view it a certain way because experience, but not... Like, people should not yell at other people about. Starin is how old? Yeah, he's not young, but also before he was turned, he was 39. So he wasn't even old when he was... Before he was a vampire. Well, I mean, he wasn't even young. I mean, he was young, but he wasn't, like, young in that sense. Not that it fits the description. Um... 
But definitely white, like super white. <laughs> that that's true. It's <laughs> white. <laughs> it, it's called the pale elf. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, elf age different than humans. True, but he also has the appearance of someone around thirty nine. Like he doesn't have the appearance of someone who like he doesn't have the appearance of a a late teen teen to early twenties boy or young man. So it's it, that is also not accurate. But anyway, should we get into the game? <laughs> just went on a whole rant. <laughs> uh, but it just it just bothers me because it, uh, the reason why I see it is because, you know, I'm not talking about just TikToks and stuff or comment sections. I'm also talking about in people's streams. And sometimes I can't keep my mouth sh shut and I, I have to say something. If people in chat say it, not, not the streamer, but if the people in chat say it, I'm like, is he though? No, he's not, and I, I like, I, I don't want to be the, the, you know, you. Well, actually, I don't, I don't want to be that person, but it's just, at some point, I just get enough, and I just need to. If it was just one random person who said it, it wouldn't bother me. But when everyone does it, it's like people. That's how people learn the wrong definition of a word because so many people end up using it in the wrong way, and there's so, so many other words. Uh, that ha that has happened to as well. I can't really think of them at the top of my head, but I know because it, this has bothered me in other situations as well. And yeah, it's just exhausting because it's one of those things that as long as enough people use the word in a different way, the word itself will actually change its meaning. And I know that languages are supposed to be very fluid and they're supposed to change. But like, these are already slang words. If it's already a slang word, why do you... Why? <laughs> you know, <laughs> it's different. <laughs> it's just different because it's... I don't know. Thank you, Ryan. Um, Game who? Yeah. <laughs> Eight more minutes for a full hour, yeah. I can also see because that's when the ad is gonna happen. <laughs> uh, you never you never even thought about the ages of the origins in Baldur's Gate 3? Mm, it's very interesting. I think Gale is supposed to be in his mid-30s. Starn is 39 because it says so on his grave. I actually have a picture of it if you want to see because someone has translated it. I mean, many people have. Uh, let me see. I actually, actually screenshotted it the other day because I wanted to have it on my my phone in case people actually asked because someone said the wrong thing someplace and I just wanted to have it somewhere. Um, well, anyway, I can I can share that later. But he is thirty nine, and uh, Shadowheart she is I think she's like forty seven or forty eight. No, 48, I think she is, but she's also half elf, so she also doesn't age uh, in the same way as humans do. Um, you're American, you're not allowed to learn the correct definitions of words. <laughs> Many minority words get that treatment a lot. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was like the. Oh. Which word was it? Uh, I, I thought of the perfect word to bring up, but I don't remember now. I forgot about it immediately. Oh, and also how, you know, the word brain rot? That actually started out as an autistic term, but now everyone uses it and they use it in the wrong way. Not everyone. Most people seem to get it right, but there are a lot of people who think it's a negative thing. Um, Lazel is youngest and Will is second youngest, pretty sure. I actually don't know Will's age, but I do know Lazel is supposed to be like 20... 21 or something? It's more like over 50, I think, because it's like 40 years in the play. Yeah, no, she's 48, I think, because I think she was... 
eight years old when she was kidnapped. So she's been there for 40 years, but I think she was supposed to be eight when she was kidnapped. I think. I'm not entirely sure. I'm not going to say for sure, but she it is true that she's at least over 40. Mm, Halson is over 30, uh, 300, uh, 350. Yeah, I think Jahir is also like 250 or 75 or something. Wouldn't doubt that you have a mild form of Asperger's. I mean, we got a case of the brain box. It's that's the Asperger's is not a term anymore. It's it's not used anymore. It's all autism. Um, because I got I got kind of diagnosed with the same thing, in a way, without actually getting it officially diagnosed. Um, but it's it's not used anymore because of the origin of the word. You wanted to say, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Either way, uh, that could be. That could be. But I also talked. There was also someone who said that they. They liked to differentiate between, between the two because they felt like. Because they were autistic and they thought that someone who has Asperger's is not. Um, they don't have the same struggle as, struggles as they do, so they wanted to differentiate between the two. Um, and then there are the other the people on the other side who want to differentiate because they think that they are superior, uh, which is kind of why they wanted to get rid of the word as well, because of... Well, I'm not going to go into the history of it, because I, I don't have all the details to... Uh, you know, inform people properly about it, but you guys can look it up. <laughs> you can look it up. Um, you know exactly. Well, yeah, because they sound the same. <laughs> the levels of autism were like the mild or severe as well. Mm, yeah. You honestly could not spell the correct term without looking it up. Yeah, so it's just easier in a lot of ways to just call it autism. <laughs> but yeah, actually some people have used it on one of my videos as well on YouTube. You know, the one where I I fought Melania from start to finish. Someone tried to insult me by saying L2 brain rot uh, or something like that. Like the only thing that I thought of in that sense, uh, in when when I read that was like, that's not what brain rot means, <laughs> which is just a perfect, a perfect example of why I am autistic <laughs> because. I wasn't insulted. I was just like, "You're." That's not what the word means. Get it right. If you're gonna insult me, insult me in the correct way. You know. <laughs> I just thought. I just thought about that now. That's actually really funny. <laughs> that's actually really funny. Um. <laughs> but yeah, we we're gonna open the game. We're gonna open the game, and then we're gonna do a wheel spin. We're gonna do a wheel spin right off the bat. And we did finish the whole Castle Morn and Weeping Peninsula last time. We didn't do every single thing in Weeping Peninsula, but we did almost everything. And um, today we're gonna meet Blythe and we're gonna go to Liurnia. And I think we're gonna go to Liurnia. I think so. <clears throat> it's also why so many girls or if have or people raised as girls take not get diagnosed because how the origins and stuff when started yeah 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 and when i started talking to my doctor about it you know what she said because i i was i obviously wanted to have an official diagnosis because what my like that one psychologist told me because he only told me but he didn't write it down 
so it's not in my my like it's not in my official records i guess um so i wanted to to get it official but then my doctor said well, you're not autistic or you don't look it's autistic to me like well what what are what are they supposed to look like you know and how the fuck do you know just by looking at someone yeah so she she told me that and she didn't want to help me um so i can't really uh, i had to fig figure out a different way why so many wait hold on um is a woo howling sound or is that like a s <laughs> no that is a howling sound right that is a howling sound you hate that yeah i hate it too and i am now on a waiting list to change my doctor because she is not helpful at all and she i don't i don't know she also she is not she is questionable in other ways too she actually told me that having like if you're gonna lose weight getting less than a thousand calories each day is not too little if you're trying to lose weight that's what she told me which is super damaging you should not you should that's when i first started realizing that you know this this woman she's full of shit because that is not healthy. And not healthy. Gaming after the ad break, we did it, yeah. <laughs> it would probably be like, okay, and gaslight yourself to being, I guess, they are right. Yeah, I mean, I've done that so much already that I'm like, I've reached the point where I know that people are just not um, educated enough on the subject. Even if they are uh, medical professionals, they are just... Everything they learn these days is very outdated. And they don't get new information. Or they don't... Like, if, they, if they're going to get new information, they have to... They have to... Um, you know, go out, go out of their way to learn more about that specific uh, condition or uh, diagnosis or something. Because they just... You have to keep up, you know? But a lot of people don't. And there's so much new research being done every single... Every single year. You like this song? Me too. Me too. <laughs> Calories are magic text. Mm. <laughs> you can eat that little, but it's rarely recommended. Yeah, and it's... Less than a thousand... Yeah, yeah. Hey, Kaya! Yeah, it's... I actually took an official, uh... Not test, but like, um... A measurement at a place where they actually specialized in these things. And I was told, based on all the measurements that they did... I did this in January, by the way, so it's not that long ago. I was told that the amount of calories that I could have every day and still lose weight... And, like, lose weight in a healthy way was around 1,800. Or, like, it was between 18 and 1,900 calories each day was what I was told. And, like, well, that's almost twice as much as my doctor told me, so. <laughs> oh, that was, yeah, yeah. So now I'm waiting on for a new doctor. Uh, it sucks, especially when they are the professionals, because they're supposed to be professionals. Exactly. Exactly. Um, but I hope you're doing well, Kaya. You never take a look at calorie stuff. I... If I'm torn between something, I usually do. Like, two different alternatives, I look at the calories, like, okay, I'm gonna stick with the one with the least of uh, the two. <laughs> You hate it when doctors are both judgmental and ill-informed. Yeah. Me too. Me too. 
Okay, we're gonna open the game. We're gonna open the game. And I'm gonna pause the music. Uh, it's almost like the calories are not the only thing that affects stuff. Yeah, it also depends on if you have any other conditions and stuff. Calories are not really that... Uh, it doesn't really work the same way because I think it has something to do with insulin and stuff as well. But I'm I'm not a professional side. So I don't know. Wait, no, I started I started Baldur's Gate three. <laughs> I started Baldur's Gate three. Never mind. I, okay, let me let me just <laughs> yeah. The, the as as I <laughs> Baldur's Gate three brain rot. That is that is the <laughs> okay. Okay, <laughs> never mind. It was an honest mistake, okay? <laughs> you are by no means a professional, but you think most deficit stuff you've seen is 1500, not under 1000? Yeah, and it also depends on... It depends on a lot of things. It depends on... If you want to lose weight in a healthy way that is gonna last and not just like a, a diet, then losing a lot over a short period of time is not a good idea. Fifteen hundred and workout or walk, mm. but it really depends on your body type and and um. Yeah, why isn't it showing up though? It should be showing up. You've been EP, but okay. That's good. Well, not the EP part, but okay. The the okay part. You thought you heard the intro? To <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I yeah. No, don't call him that. But it's true. I have, I have, I have, uh, you know, come to terms with the, the, I've come to terms with the, with a probable fact. <laughs> yes, I said that. Then I'll probably stay single for the rest of my life. So this, Starn is my husband now. <laughs> That's just how it is. Um, you're still here, your boys are just demanding all your attention. <laughs> have a good one, have a good one. Also, thank you so much for the lurk. Um, on a side note, if you remember correctly, it's 30 or 33 calories times body weight per day for base need. Hmm. Good thing that I don't know what my my weight is because I don't want to know that. <laughs> Good thing that I don't know. I don't like it. Cute. <laughs> Ryan. <laughs> uh, thank you for the 40 bits. Okay, then we <laughs> Uh Let's see. You don't know what these clips are? I, well, I I am meaning to... Yeah, we're going to spin the wheel. That's what I was going to do. I was going to bring up the wheel. We're going to spin the wheel. Hold on. I should have... I should add it to my, my stream deck. Hiding and unhiding the, the wheel. I just... I just forgot. I just forgotten to do it. So you're going to see my, my OBS for a bit. Okay. Let's spin the wheel.
Well, that is definitely it. That, that, we, we finally got the gay sword, Orion. <laughs> oh, we finally got the gay sword. <laughs> uh, it's definitely not s straight anymore. Uh, brain EP. Mm. I feel that. I'm also very sleepy today. Okay, let's find it. Well, these are the curved swords, at least. Uh, hey, there it is. It was right above <laughs> the one that I am using. Hey. Wait, what is uh causes frost buildup? Okay. Interesting. Um do you want a reminder for that? Yeah, sure, I can I can have a reminder for that. Hold on, let me just bump up the audio because I was told that the the volume was a little bit low the first stream. Uh no more straight swords. Exactly. Exactly. Dude, game. Ugh, too stuck. You're... I need a ba bigger desk. <laughs> I need a bigger desk. It even has like, it's not frost, but it's like metal that's supposed to look like frost. Do you see that? Hold on. Let me... Okay, I want to read about it first. Weapon wielded by the Knights of Zamor who earned great renown during the war against the Giants. In apparent devotion to winter, the curved blade is styled after an icy wind and imbued with a powerful frost effect. The more ice storm plunge the curved sword into the ground, building power before unleashing a freezing storm that batters the surroundings. This could be interesting. Waiting signal for t the timer. Yeah, we just need to. We just need to get to where the the combat is. You didn't want to. <laughs> I see. I see that I have a, a a message on Discord. I can't see who it is, but I'm, I'm gonna assume that it's it's tuning. There cannot be too many reminders unless it's too much. <laughs> Haunt some enemies. Yeah. Yeah, so the plan is to go down here anyway. But yeah, sure we can we can start the timer once I get to the 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 giant. We can we can We can practice on the giant. Yeah, we can start the timer now. Oh, nice. Up the butt. Ow. Let me try the heavy attack as well. Ow! He did a heavy attack too. <laughs> Ow. I, I started healing at a bad time. It was my first death! <laughs> I was like... That was terrible. My first death, thank you. <laughs> I was like, this is gonna happen very- I, I had a feeling that it would happen very early on today. <laughs> Orion Wolfia cheered. X323. Orion, why are you rewarding me for dying? <laughs> I'm actually crying a little bit. Not not out of silence, but it was just funny. <laughs> Uh, thank you so much, Ryan. 
<laughs> that was embarrassing though. I have to say. Oh, this one also has more... Uh, oh, shit. Stop it. Stop it. No. I want to do the thing. Oh. Holy crap. Orion? <laughs> Orion, thank you so much for gifting us up to... Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I don't know why I, I died there. Well, I mean, I know why, but it was like, it shouldn't have happened. Like that, that was a terrible way to die. It wasn't even a good, good, and um, um. I didn't have a good reason to die, is what I mean. your first time it's it is my first time <laughs> forgot how to do the counter commands do you death counter for this child i have not but if you want to um i know palm did it on his own uh but i haven't enabled anything like when i did when i played last of p but for this one i haven't uh haven't started anything like that You lost the bet? Wait, what bet? What was the bet? Uh, it wasn't gravity? Oh, that, that bet, I see. <laughs> you think you have it screenshotted somewhere how to do it, but you don't know where it is? Yeah, I don't know either. Let's see. Oh yeah, this one is going to bring me to the cave with the, uh, with the bear, the huge bear. The big bear. Wait. Oh, is that the gold tinted, uh... Gold tinged. Not tinted, but tinged. Gold tinged poop. This one terrified me on my first playthrough. <laughs> because, of course, it has loot and I wanted it. Yeah, but we, we're going here because of Blythe. Should we, should we attempt to... Now that I've died once, I don't care. I just wanted to not die at all. Or see how long I could go without dying. But now that I have died... It doesn't matter. I do not remember their moveset at all. 
You tried to hug me, it didn't work. I didn't consent, so you, you, you can't do that. Yeah, I'm doing so little damage with this weapon. <laughs> because I haven't leveled it up. Oh! Nice. it again. Boop its nose. We're trying. Ow. No. I didn't want to be hugged. It's not what I want. Ow. See, it does the delayed attack that I hate. <laughs> uh, it does the delayed attacks that I absolutely hate. I don't like it. There we go. It's just pra practice. It's just practice. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go to Blythe now. Uh, I just don't want to die. I hear him howling. <gasps> Here. think? Isn't this it? Oh, it is, but on the other side. <laughs> there we go. There he is. Yeah, we need to go back to Kale. Uh, now that we've heard him howling. You can wait a little bit to start the timer because I want to go and talk to Kale. Blythe the half wolf. So that the timer won't. Uh, uh, there we go. We love Blythe. Oh. Uh. Might as well. Oh, okay. Well, it helps, at least. Wait. Weren't you... Well, you're back. Care to buy something? You just like rune bears? Me too. About the howling in the mistwood. The howl of a wolf. In the mistwood. I suppose he must still be skulking about. I know. Why not meet him for yourself? Next time you hear the wolf's howl, make this signal right under the source. Ah, oh, don't fret. There is nothing to fear. I just have an inkling the two of you might hit it off. Yay! He's my friend! There are others of my people who yet survive in the if the mood takes you when you meet one. 
and offer them some trade, won't you? My people, Give it parts with your sword. <laughs> all have long been spurned by the grace of gold, which is why we cannot settle, but instead are forced into this pitiful, that might, journey. That may but fix your shoulder and neck that, issues when it does that. Things are not so different for us now. Though the Elden Ring is shattered, I think this makes us kindred spirits. I'm still so sad that they cut out his quest because it would have actually made the frenzied ending a good ending. Or not a good ending, but a better ending than it is. Goodbye. Because it actually it actually gives you a good reason to do it, you know? Hey Marty! How you doing? What happened? Wait, did something happen? Okay, south. Yeah, I'm also not a fan of the, the rune bears. <laughs> They're actually terrifying. Well, I mean, they used to be. Now I'm, I'm okay with it, but it's just, it, they used to be terrifying. <gasps> Hello, look at him! It's my friend! Oh, I love Blythe. He's one of my favorites. He is one of my favorites. Let me... Let's see. Which one is it again? I mean, it's the snap, but I don't remember where it is. Is it just called snap? Finger snap. There it is. Okay. Okay. Hello! Who goes there? Carly sent you, did he? Never the bloody busybody. Hmm. Maybe to him you don't seem so strange. The name's Blythe. I'm looking for a man who goes by Darrowell. He fled somewhere nearby. <laughs> or so I've heard. Come tell me if you find him before I do. I can offer you ample reward. <laughs> the funny thing is when he said, I'm looking for a man, and like my brain just went, I'm looking for a man in finance. <laughs> because of the meme. <laughs> I'm looking for a... <laughs> I'm looking for a man named Darrowell. <laughs> You thought I was crying? No, well, I mean, I am kind of crying, but it's been, it's, it's not, it's not crying in that sense. It's just my, my eyes are very wa watery today. <laughs> I'm looking for a man named Daryl. <laughs> because he said it in the same, like, snappy way, you know? Darrowell is nothing but a traitor and in need of a fitting end to his tale. <laughs> Darrowell is nothing but and in need of a fit. Okay. <laughs> uh, he's so tall. I know. I I love I love Blythe. We also have the same. It's, we we have the same uh, cloak. Do you see? We're matching. Best buds. I'm actually wearing the same <laughs> armor as well. I didn't know. <laughs> I forgot that I wore the same armor as well. But we're matching. Yeah, I'm just not wearing the same pants, I think. Am I? No, I'm not. I didn't know. Well, I knew that I had the same cape, but I haven't really paid attention to the the armor I was wearing. I mean, I could change the head as well. Wait, not inventory. Um. No, that's not it. That's Malekith. Uh, but yeah, I'm not- I'm not crying, I'm just- <laughs> my eyes are very watery today. <laughs> uh... Wait, do I not have it? Did I not pick it up on this playthrough? I know where it is, though. Yeah, I don't think I have it, actually. That's strange. 
I know exactly where it is, but we're not gonna... Okay, well, anyway. It's also how you can just find the head. Mm. Yeah, look at us! Look at us! We're matching! We're matching! Going to get the red hood? Uh, yeah, probably. Maybe. I mean, I didn't really think about it, but we can do that. Um, but yeah. Blythe is the best boy. Chris calls him his husband as well. Which I have agreed to. I have allowed him. <laughs> I want to see how uh, leveling up the weapon has helped. Ah, no, 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 shit. Well, it was a terrible position there. Dude, camera, are you okay? I, I don't want to be here. <laughs> I can't see shit. You couldn't give me iframes with that? No, I guess not. What did I kill? Oh, it was a boar. I was like, what? I can't see. You locked off. That was a loud squeal from that boar. It actually scared me a little bit. Like, what did I do? Okay, so it did help leveling up. This did this went a lot faster. Shit. Even though it was only like three levels, I think. Uh but yeah, let's go fight. No, wait, we can go in here first. You found one with some magic hacker palm command counter thing, but you don't know if it's the one th that worked. Hmm. It's too complicated for you. Yeah, if palm shows up, we can just ask him. But uh, if it's it's okay though. It's not like it's gonna be difficult to remember <laughs> the number at this point. Um. Okay, let's go to... Uh, here. Here's the nearest one. But yeah, I, I, I don't... My eyes are just... I'm not crying, but I... I feel like I'm crying. Yeah, I don't want to, um... I don't want him to be in the fight, though. But I do want to talk to him. Wait. I thought he would be right here. Isn't this the one? Isn't this the, the, the jail? Forlorn Hound? Yeah, and uh, that that is that should be the one. Because I, I do remember where it was, but I, I just Shouldn't his uh summoning sign be here? Right. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Th 
Thank you, Ryan, for gifting sub to... I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Inside it? So I need to enter it? Okay. I thought you had to, like, invite him to join in. But not here. I didn't know it would be here. Now, I'm not going to summon him, but I hope that he appears outside at least so I can talk to him afterwards. Even if I don't summon him. Do you know if he does that? Oh, damn, he was staggered quickly. I didn't even attack him. This was one of the most fun bosses that I, I learned the moveset of. Like, it was one of the most satisfying ones. In my first playthrough, now I don't remember it anymore. <laughs> Now I don't remember it anymore. <laughs> uh. Okay, there we go. Bloodhound Fang. Uh started to watch the Elden Ring animations from the start and it was fun to watch them again from the start. Mm. There he is! Yeah, I'm glad we get to talk to him anyway. Right. There you are. Had to work for it, but it's done. <laughs> Don't say I'm not a man of my word. Here's your prize. He's just poking me in the face. <laughs> hey, thank you. Oh, yes. I should say. If you venture north to Rhea Lucaria and come across a venerable blacksmith who's a little on the large side. Tell him I sent you. Oh, I love EG too. be sure to treat you right. I owe you one, I reckon. That's enough chit-chat for now. It's Wait. That's enough chit-chat for now. It's time we parted ways. You think he comes here even if you defeat Derival before even speaking to him? If you are not gone to- No. No, it, he doesn't because I did that in- I- I never found him- I mean, I did this before I found him in the Misty Wood, so I never got the Howling in or anything. He did not appear here for me. So the first time I met Blythe was in... in uh, at the manor. Let's see... You didn't have time or energy to finish all of them. I don't think that I've finished all of them either. I, I don't remember where I left off, but I do have... Quite a few left. Uh, okay. We can go to uh, Kenneth's fort. You've seen the new ones. I just also need to see the animation with over time, over time how it goes. Mm. I don't remember the last one that I saw. But it's been a it's been a, it's been a while. It has been a while. I think one of the most fun ones was... I think one with... The Rune Bears. I'm not entirely sure. But there's so many fun ones. <laughs> the Mimic one is still one of the best for you. Mm.
Is that also new wheel spin as well? Wait, what do you mean? Jesus Christ. Going to sleep. Take care, everyone. Have a good night, Kaya. I hope you sleep well. Oh, damn. He got... He died quickly from that. I like the moveset of this. have to kill him. We, he got killed by that alone. I mean, it's risky, but... Ow. Dude. That's what you get. That's what you get. Since since there was so much uh, downtime there, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna still use the weapon inside the the castle, the 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 fort. They're also funny and relatable as well. Oh, 10 subs on the counter. Oh yeah, that's true. Hold on. Let me just let me just finish using this weapon in here and then I can do a a wheel spin after because I didn't do much with this weapon. Really? Damn, I didn't see you. <laughs> uh, I do like this though. The the weapon art. Not the well, I mean the weapon itself is also okay. Just <laughs> uh. Yeah, I like how you just spin around. Doing like little pirouettes with the weapon. I don't know why I healed there. I didn't have to do that. You gotta get your PC, uh, has a- You gotta go, your PC has apparently started dying. You don't know if you need new thermal paste or new graphics card. Oh, damn. Yeah, that is- that is scary. I hope you figure it out. Thank you so much for hanging out, though. I hope- I hope your PC will be okay. Going to make a tier list for the weapons, use this run afterwards. That's- that's a good idea. If I remember, though, it, it might be difficult for me to remember how much I, I liked, or if it was memorable or not, you know? Depends on how many I get to try. Ah! Uh. That's mean. Okay. Uh, that dude was terrifying on my first playthrough as well. <laughs> uh, but now I'm just jumping in without a second thought. Which means, you know, New Game Plus, kind of nice. I won't lie. It is kind of nice. Because you, you feel a little bit more uh, safe at the beginning of the game. I can't say anything about late game, though.
That I don't know yet. That I don't know yet. But yeah, we're gonna do another wheel spin after this. I just want to make sure that I get to a place with some combat. Uh, I also need to fast travel out of here and go back so he can spawn here. Can it height? Sir, can it height? <laughs> I forgot what's... Yeah, it's just infested with these uh, tiny, tiny ones, isn't it? Fort Height. Misbegotten. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's. Uh. Wait, maybe I need. I needed to. Maybe I needed to just rest here. <laughs> uh, uh, that's yeah. I forgot to rest. I just teleported. I didn't rest. My bad. My bad. Let's let's try that again. Fortnite a uh, fort height at night. Yeah. Fort height at night. I think TP counts as rest if that in that sense because quit outs count. But nothing had respawned though. Or maybe I need- do I need to go and talk to him? I guess I maybe need to talk to him on top of the- the thing. Yeah. Um, yeah, I forgot about that. It's been- it's been such a long time. I'm surprised that I remember some of the orders. At least it's not too far. Lord Kennetite. I wish you could talk to people while being on torrent. Ah, I've been waiting for you with bated breath. Did you manage to recapture my fort? Oh, excellent news. Just wonderful and the knight's dead to boot indeed well done my friend well done indeed mm. i knew i was right to trust you now, Me. here's your reward as promised go ahead it's all yours Erd steel dagger right then time for me to head to the fort i've much to do mm. first i'll have to re-establish communication with the demi humans what's that look you don't believe me? Well, under the Erd tree, co-mingling with the demi-humans is made possible. Even the vulgar shall not be left behind under the rule of true order. Which is why mm. I, Kenneth Height, next in line as the rightful ruler of Limgrave, have sworn to uphold it. Just you watch, my friend. Just you watch. I will watch. Ah, yes. I've, uh, I've been meaning to ask. Would you like to enter my service? I see bright things in your future, stout warrior. Enter into my service and learn the workings of the Erd Tree's true order. I mean, sure. And who knows? Perhaps sometime down the line, the grace of gold will return Look to how it clips through my helmet. Of yours. What say you? A fine accord, is it not? Um, uh, sure. Very well, very well indeed. <laughs> I knew I saw something in you. I shall await you at my fort. We shall hold a ceremony for your knighting there, I think. 
I see great things ahead of us. What, what, we are truly by what is two avocados for ten bucks? Is that a meme that I don't know? Right then. Time for me to head to life. Much to do. Because I don't know what it means. <laughs> okay, third time's the charm, okay? This time it should work. Also, I never talked to Nefeli after the Godric fight. So I think we're gonna teleport to Well, we could go to round table hall first. <laughs> this is fun. <laughs> Yeah, I really like the move set of this. You know, just spinning around. What what is this song, Ryan? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Hello. Ah, you is it? Uh, I suppose you must have seen it by now. Yes. The sorry state of my fort. Oh, indeed, it is a foul fate for a land to be without a ruler. One must be found with haste, and not that awful Godric, but a true and his mouth looks so weird. Lord of the proper lineage like to take the reins of Lingrave. I'm sorry to have lifted your hopes. But I haven't the authority to raise you to knighthood, as things stand. The great Kenneth Height issues his sincerest apology. But now, I must begin my search post-haste for a true and stalwart lord of the proper lineage to take the reins of Limgrave. Okay. I must begin for a true and... I found her. I found her. Wait. Oh. Uh, it's like um, a meme thing, you don't know. You have seen a few different, but there is this one where two characters from the Owl House. Oh. I see, I see. I never rested, or like, uh, did I never touch this grace? I thought that I did. I guess I never did. <laughs> Is the song running up that hill with different words? Oh, I see, I see. Okay, I guess we should go to round table hold first. Um <clears throat> This asshole. Uh, you haven't gone to see Garang well. No. Nope. Just as long as he doesn't stuff. I'm sure he's fine. Just thank goodness. I'm still looking. It's not easy. Wait. Do I need to talk to him first about her? Now, those eyes of a challenger find them well. Yeah. The girl, she's crest, but she has it. I saw another one. Her eye. I see you've noticed nothing special. I'm trapped. That's all the. You're a prisoner? No. 
Well, no great my being a prisoner. Besides, despite my decides here. Okay. Um <clears throat> because I want them to I need to make sure that I progress those quests as well. I'm still looking. You're telling me I don't believe if I do have this talent. I suppose I should I'll ask Master and may he does. I know he can Master tell. Hugh. Yeah. Uh, it's a song. Wait, it's been on your head most of this day. Mm. I feel that. That's me with the this <laughs> the song. That... Wait, but this door was open. You again? I thought you'd receive a summons to the round table. The Felly Lou. We met at Stonevale. I'm glad to see you here. I have something for you. I found it in Godric's grafting grounds. You were the one to defeat him. I would hazard. Make good use of it. I don't intend to make a habit of scavenging corpses. Ah, yes. I wonder if you've met him. He's in his study. The room. If you haven't already. Father is lead. I'm sure talking to him. Because I- his door was open last time I went to Round Table Hold, but now it's it was suddenly- I'll see you again, warrior. So now it was suddenly it's closed. Time I headed. I'll see you again. Kinda weird. I never were in that room? No. I just remember it was open. But how? I don't know. He's not here either. Are you? You've done. I interpret. Hey! <laughs> For the raid, stay purple. How was your stream? What were you doing? What were you playing? Hi, Winksy. And wait, Meunton? Meunton? <laughs> Welcome in. Um, a Maple Moon. Nice to see you all. And Celestial Breeze. <laughs> purple Rain. Pur pur purple Raid. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, she is. She's. She can talk. This one. Um. Hey, Chubby Kiwi. <laughs> you have to raid and run, but have a great stream. Thank you so much for the raid. But welcome in. Welcome in, everyone who is new here. Uh. I. My name is Leprechaus. I'm an Norwegian streamer. I am currently playing Elden Ring for the 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 second time. Um, the golden order. Jesus Christ, she is talking a lot. <laughs> and uh, we're currently doing a wheel spin run where I'm for every fifth sub or 1500 bits, I am doing a wheel spin. I'm about to do a wheel spin after the, the ad break that is going to happen soon. Um, because we, we have reached another one. And uh, what I do then is that I'm using the, the weapon that it lands on. For 20 minutes. And uh, this is the last weapon we used. <laughs> also, thank you so much for the follow. And go check out Stay Purple as well. I, I met them through... Um, was it Maple Moon? Or was it someone else? I think... It was at least through Baldur's Gate 3. I do I do remember that. Because uh, we've all been... We've all, all been in, in our little Baldur's Gate 3 bubble. Um... <laughs> <laughs> but have a good one though have a good one stay purple and i hope you s you stay purple after all that is that is very important that is very important let's see if rajir is here <gasps> rajir is here and it rhymes ah we meet again after all i apologize for any offense given by my bearing but i'm quite unable to move you see so what do you need I don't need anything. I just wanted to talk to you. 
But yeah, thank you so much for the follow. We do have anonymous follows, by the way, for people who just want to lurk. Hold on. I let me just snooze this ad really quickly before it starts because it starts any second now. Damn, I had two seconds before it started. <laughs> I don't want people to be in an ad right as they raid in because you know that that's not that's not good. That's not good. Um Yeah, so I have only died once. I died once today, and it was a stupid death. So far I've only died once in this playthrough. And honestly, I won't lie, I'm a little bit salty about it. <laughs> Not even close. Limit testing for sure. Yeah, yeah. I've defeated Godric. Ah, you defeated Godric and claimed yourself a great rune. I did. Mm. Looks like we both got what we wanted out of Stormvale, didn't we? Well done, friend. Something to mark the occasion. Go on. Take it. I already have this. As you might have guessed, <laughs> I still can't move. My fighting days are behind me. No need to be polite. I've no use for it anymore. No. Oh, that's sad. About the corpse under Stormvale. The misshapen corpse under Stormvale. That is a sacred relic of the Black Knives plot, as that famed night of assassination is known. It happened during the golden age of the Erd Tree, long before the shattering of the Elden Ring. Someone stole a fragment of the Rune of Death from Malaketh, the Black Blade, and on a bitter night, murdered Godwin the Golden. That was the first recorded death of a demigod in all history, and it became the catalyst. Soon, mm. the Elden Ring was smashed, and thus sprang forth the war known as the Shattering. I once wished to become a scholar, you see. I've spent many an hour scouring the archives for knowledge of that fateful plot. The world has grown crooked, and if you intend to put it to rights, you'd better understand what happened to make it this way. Hmm? And hmm? that thing is to blame for the shape I'm in now. I urge the utmost caution. Don't disturb the corpse more than necessary. Wait, what would happen if we... Can you distor disturb it more? <laughs> because I don't think we could do anything more there. Um, you're trying to pull... Put all the events on a timeline with new information, but it's hard because it's already so much. Mm. Ah, so you've met D. D is an old friend. We found ourselves journeying together for a time, bound by our exploration of death. But our paths have since diverged, never again to cross. Though that's hardly an uncommon fate for two friends. Mm. D was telling me that he discovered the mark of the centipede. The centipede is an ancient symbol of the curse mark. As long as whoever finds and uses it is not nefarious by nature, then we may be able to form an alliance. If only I could speak to them in person, and if they were like you, all the better. I guess I should go to the the catacombs where you find that, or like the. You just want to talk about spoilers? <laughs> no spoilers. But yeah, let us let us do the wheel spin before the ad break, okay? Let us do the wheel spin. Uh, uh, okay, so this was the last one we got. Mm -mm -mm. Crystal sword. I am not sure w which one it is, but we'll see. We'll see. And theories you have or lack of? Lack of theories? Okay, crystal sword. Oh, is this one? It's this one. Oh, it's more of a strength and intelligence weapon. Um, sword fashion from pure crystal, a deep impossible, a, a deep impossible for a human, and wreathed with powerful magic. Its attack scales with intelligence. Inscrutable crystallians have but one clear purpose to safeguard their crystals unto the end. One theory posits that they yearn for the return of their creator who will carve for them 
New Brethren. Spinning Slash. Skill favored by dexterous warriors slash foes as your body spins. Additional input allows for a follow-up attack. Wait, I forgot to actually equip it. Are we getting an add? Um, now? So I'm going to take a quick break and then I'll be right back. Okay? I will be right back. I'll see you guys in a bit. I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Okay? Okay. Oh, now look. You've scared off the little snack.
Okay. We're back. We're back. I'm sorry if uh, I was gone a little while longer than intended. Um, but I also decided to get some some more to drink. Let's do do this. Should we level this weapon up a little bit? Oh. I got all stuttery when I opened the game. <laughs> um, well, thank you for the 35 bits, Ryan. During the the ad break, I also reset the uh, reset the um, the subs so it would be how it was supposed to be. <sighs> you wish you could have something to snack on. You don't actually even like avocados. Back already. I'm kind of neutral no when matter. it comes to avocado avocados. Lay out your arms. Um. Let's bring it to seven. Okay. Let us go to Leonia. Or should we talk to? No. No, we can go here. I was like, it sounded like it started raining, but it didn't. Also, I forgot to open something. I usually try to open up Afterburner. Oh shit, so my, my PC can get some extra- that, That's why like, I thought it was like, is it rain or is it wind? Or is it my PC? And then I started thinking about, oh, maybe I need to have Afterburner up. <laughs> it wasn't my PC though, but it's just a- It's just to get some extra air for my PC. That is all. Air, you say? <laughs> Get air, lose HP. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. Dude, I can't believe that you still remember that code so well. <laughs> it's so funny. Wait, was this the correct one? I want to go with the one that wasn't correct. Hmm. Ah, fuck. It's ingrained in you at this point? Mm. Like, I would not remember it if you hadn't repeated it so many times that I actually do remember it now, but if you hadn't, I would have forgotten it long ago. I think. Wait, is there anything here at all? Damn, that's disappointing. Uh, <laughs> that's disappointing. We have some others, but they just barely evade you how they actually were worded. Yeah, that's how I usually remember things. It's like, I remember the, the gist of it, but not the... the, the the full thing, you know? Like the mystical musical man you'd never see or hear from Witchwood. That I do not remember. <laughs> that I do not remember. Shabriri Grape. Let's give it to to the one outside. Grape. Got any grapes? I do, but not the ones you probably want. Hello. You want you want you want some grapes? Hello? Is someone there? My name is Hayata. 
and I'm journeying in search of the distant light. If I might be so bold as to ask, would you donate any Shabriri grapes in your possession to me? My eyesight has been weak since birth, you see. I can't tell which way I'm supposed to go next, but when I eat one of those grapes, I can feel a distant light in the back of my eye. So this is still a mystery to me. To my true duty is a finger maiden. Why her and Arena is like looks the same and I think they also have the same voice actor but it's like I never really found out the connection here like why why <laughs> I think she kind of takes her body yeah but why her specifically though and who what what was she like beforehand give a shabiri grape oh, many thanks to you now I can feel the distant light once more. You are most kind indeed. May the blessing of the fingers. But she also be don't know what the grapes are for, or like she doesn't know what they actually are. So she's kind of clueless, you know. So why? How would she know how to take over the body the same way that Shabriri does, you know? Uh, they did a new song of that recently. I did not know. <laughs> And he's also associated with the frenzy, so you think it's related some way? You know, got gotten to that part of the lore videos. Mm. Yeah, I just I just can't really make it make sense because she she just she just uses the grapes, but she doesn't really know. Like I I don't know how she has the power to take over someone's body when she knows so little, you know. But at the same time, I don't I don't know. Stuff. She just licked my hand. <laughs> you want to see her? Hey, Tushta. Say hi. What is that? Oh, it's it's. It was a, a thread <laughs> on her tail. Um. Until you tell about them, maybe she just doesn't know. Hey. Hey, Tushta. She really likes having her tail in my face. <laughs> hey. Which is why I always have hair, cat hair, in my face. You're tarnished, then. Believe it or not, for a... Ah. I don't know why I reacted that way, but she she knocked down foe, so he landed on my, my arm. <laughs> well, bless you. You are a true... My name is... Presuming you're in only... Apologies. I'm afraid... Oh, right. I can tell you what I you seen that straps the I'm just not that interested in his story. The academy cars you might have guessed making entry and so on when they cast the seals. Why not find without one and you'll never and if you once you would you consider I know it. <laughs> uh okay. Uh, about Selen. You've taken an apprenticeship with Selen. Well, that is something. Selen was well known. The most promising sorceress in the history of the academy. I followed her at school. But there may as well have been an ocean between us. But Selen was expelled from the academy, accused of unthinkable treatment of certain. I never paid attention to how he also much. has a Welsh I still accent. I believe the accusations. The illustrious Selen would never do such things. It's so funny how it's like you, you can kind of hear it with a bunch of them, but then some of them don't, and then. Okay, let us st uh, start the timer once I get to some enemies. Wait, what is... Uh... Yeah, these enemies should do. These enemies should do. Uh... Oh, that was close, Orion. 
Two hours, 22 minutes and 21 seconds. I was close. Okay. We can start the timer now. Was that it? I thought there were more enemies here. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Also, I don't know why, but I just thought there was a chest here as well. Oh, there you are. How's New Game Plus? Honestly, it's kind of nice. I do I do really like the New Game Plus. Because it makes you less squishy at the beginning. And, uh... But it does add some extra to it to be able to switch out the weapons and stuff. So it does give an extra challenge in that way. So that's fun. That is fun. You're new. Surprised you. No matter. Why don't? Oh, uh, don't. Okay, let's just go and fight the. Uh, what is his name? Adon or something? The fireball dude. He should be right up here. So we get some some action out of this weapon. While the timer is running. Jesus Christ, I have so many cat hairs around my nose. Or in my nose. You're stronger in tanker, but so are all the enemies and bosses. True. And I'm also using weapons that I... Often I don't level them up either, so they're... Not really... That strong. <laughs> Adon is the name. Don't you dare heal. Fuck you. Only I'm allowed to do that. Attacking at the same time. <laughs> he stopped his attack. That's funny. <laughs> A D B L Smo, but Mage. Wait. I'm. Um... I'm just using a a weapon that I'm I was uh, that I got on the wheel spin. So I'm I'm trying it out. It's it's uh it's okay. It's okay. Let's see. Where should we go? There's so many places to go, you know? That's where we came from. Mm. It just meant that dude in the jail had a similar model to Smell and D as one, but is a caster. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, I never played Dark Souls 1, so I'm like, I know the names, but I don't have like any, any, um, 
any like images attached to the names. It's the, it's the tiny man that needs to die. God damn it. Stuck in a tree. Typical me. Why am is everything that I'm saying rhyming today? <laughs> Uh, sorry for the- no, 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 it's not out of context. I'm just- I am- I am out of context. Well, no, wait, maybe not. Maybe not in that sense, but I'm just- I like the spinning. Ow. Wait, I didn't heal. Okay, so the weapon isn't too bad, but... Uh, no, 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 um, there is already a quote. Oh, oh, the, the tiny need, okay, yeah, I, 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 <laughs> I, I, I realized that I said it in a different way. <laughs> I realized that I said it in a different way, it's not the same. My bad. Ow, fuck, I didn't know you could reach that far. Stop it. I just didn't- I just don't have the patience to wait and take my time. <laughs> um, I think what are you gonna do is New Game Plus as well once you beat the DLC and go through it all again. Mm. Yeah, I have not done the DLC. I'm planning on doing that with this playthrough. New game plus seven is super hard to hear. Yeah, I mean, isn't that the most difficult one you can have? Doesn't it kind of stop at new game plus, even though you can like, no, uh, new game plus seven. I think after that, it just doesn't get any more difficult. Um, ch chonky. <laughs> You gonna leave your lurk so you can before you start stream. Also, tattooed bard. Just, just this is just a tip, uh, just a helpful tip, um, because I know you you say that quite often, but and for me it doesn't really matter too much, but it's not considered very good etiquette to to tell people that you're gonna stream in other people's chat. A lot of people tend to even. Uh, ban people for doing that when you're new in or especially if you're new in someone's chat but even if you're not new it tends to not be considered an okay thing to do but again like I, I don't really mind too much I'm just saying that a lot of people don't really it's considered a very not okay thing to do on Twitch in general um, no, 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 that, uh, that's why I'm saying it, uh, because I knew that you probably didn't know. Um, um, <laughs> just going to nap them. <laughs> um, because it, it, it kind of falls in under the, the self-promo thing that a lot of people uh, have as like rules and stuff in their channels. Um, but I know that you didn't know, that's, that's why I'm telling you. But you're all good. I'm just, I'm just saying it for your sake, not mine. Um, but I hope you have a good one. I hope you have a good one. And also, thank you so much for the lurk. Uh, I do appreciate it. Mm. Yeah, I'm not sure where, where I was supposed to go. I'm just, I just, <laughs> I just ran around. <laughs> um.
Yeah, I don't want to deal with the revenants. The revenants are not... Not it. They're not it. Hey, silly V. You just heard... Uh, since you over overheard the interaction, just wanted to say that you have no plans to nap nor stream. <laughs> well, thank you for the information. <laughs> but thank you so much for telling me. <laughs> How are you doing, though? Hope you're doing well. Dude, I'm... I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing at all. Also, I keep using the weapon art instead of... Um, instead of just a regular light attack, which costs me more damage. But it's it's fine. I just I'm just trying to to try out this this weapon, you know. Trying to try out, by the way. No, I meant. Um, I forgot to switch. I forgot to switch the flask. <laughs> but also, thank you so much for the follow. We do have anonymous follows for anyone who just wants to lurk and and, and hang out in peace, you know. Um. But it's spin to win, it's true. Oh shit. Why am I always on torrent when I see these? And I just, I just wanna, I don't wanna... No, no! Like, I don't need it, but I, <laughs> when I see it, I want it. <laughs> uh, you lost so many fights because you sipped wrong colored juice at- wait, what? Wrong colored juice at what are you talking about? <laughs> okay, so I was kind of heading the right way. Um How does the weapon wheel been work? Um oh yeah the <laughs> Yeah, that the that, that that's how it works. I I just I just um for every fifth sub, just any any type of sub, resubs or any any type of sub, but it, it's sub points though, um, and fifteen hundred bits. I will do a wheel spin where I'm gonna use the weapon that the wheel lands on for twenty minutes, which is uh, it's been it's been a lot of fun so far. I will be using this for for a little while longer though because I've just been riding around a lot now instead of actually using the weapon. So the weapon that I'm using right now is one that I got from the wheel spin. Um Yeah, I wanted to go here. So we can find Nefeli Lou and uh talk to her again. Oh, it's you. Well, what do you make of it? What's happened to this village? It is me. I witnessed a sight much the same in my infancy. The oppression of the weak. Murder and pillage unchecked. A waking nightmare made by men. Mm. But this time, I'm a woman grown. And though the suffering cannot be undone, I can still mete out justice. Justice to the oppressors. Let the scars I carve remind them. I am Nefeli Lu, warrior. Indeed you are. But this time, I'm the Okay, I just want to see. To the Let the scars I um, you heard some lore theory stuff that the flasks are like tree sap stuff or related to that corpse wax stuff. Oh, I don't think I knew that. No, that's rude. Yeah, we do like a good spe is speen, speen to ween, speen to ween. 
Um, with something like that. Hmm. There's a bit counter and sub counter below the camera, about the on stream chat as well. Yeah, yeah. That's what this this these are for. That is true. So anytime it reaches uh, the goal, I just reset it. So we've already had two wheel spins today for the subs. Cur uh, you're Norwegian. You're currently learning Bookmall in Duolingo. Oh. Oh, that's cool, that's cool. Yeah, I am Norwegian. <laughs> I am Norwegian. That is my first language. Um, But that's cool, how long have you been, been learning Norwegian? <laughs> oh, oh, they're the stupid perfumers, I hate those. I do not, I do not like them. No, don't kill me. No, that's rude. You're not supposed to heal. What, again? What? Excuse me? Let's hear about the, the jar man and uh, the albinoric woman. Please, no, dear me. <laughs> I haven't a clue. No secrets lie with me, not a one. Oh, please leave me be. Okay. Wait then, you're not one of them? No. Well. Almost a year, your partner's from Hama. Oh, I see, I see. That's cool. That's cool. Wait, where are you from, though? You you don't have to be specific or anything. Or you don't have to say at all if you don't want to. But I'm, I'm, just, I'm just curious. An Albinoric, as you can see. We're finished. The Albinoric woman. The village is finished. The curse mongers have destroyed everything. No one that remains has their wits about them. I beg you. Would you look after this medallion? Yeah. You must keep it out of the Cursemonger's hands. And if you should meet the young Albinoric Latena. Latena or Shadowheart. Down. It's Shadowheart. The chosen land awaits us Albinorics. The medallion is the key that leads to the city. It's only a quaint treasure for we who cannot make the journey. But for dear Latena. It is needed to fulfill her purpose. 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 My legs will soon fade, and with them my life. Alas, this is the immovable fate of all Albinorix. <laughs> okay, then. He's gone. He's gone. So with New Game Plus, do you keep everything you had last playthrough? Like, I guess what you're asking is what do you keep and what you don't. Yeah, you keep pretty much everything except key items and... Um, and bell bearings, I guess, I think. You lose great runes. Yeah, you, you don't keep great runes. You don't keep bell bearings or... Do you keep glo uh, ghost glove wards? No, you... I don't remember. But yeah, you don't... You do not keep key items, but you... Every weapon and, and medallion and... Um, yeah, and grace is also you need to unlock... The... the, the Oh. The map is open, though. Like, you can see everything on the map, but the graces are not uh, available. Yeah. 
new update should allow summoning pools to be not gathered again. Wait, what do you mean? I, I don't need this, but I, I just did it anyway. <laughs> Yeah, you play this game like eight times now, but you never do New Game Plus. You always start over for some reason. Yeah, I I did it for, because of this uh, weapon wheel spin. I did it because of the weapon wheel spin. Because I needed all my weapons available to, to be able to do it. You think those you keep because they are upgrade materials? Hmm. Yeah, I, I said medallions, but I meant talismans. <laughs> I don't know why I said medallions. <laughs> uh, I'm still going to use the weapon, though, while I'm doing this, because I've been I've been just running around too much. I should have killed the dog first. Because the dog is the one that is actually painful. Ow. Dude, I'm stuck. Now I can't see. Yeah, it's always the dogs that really get me. <laughs> uh, if you unlock the summoning pool once, it should remain available in New Game Plus. Like, it could be summoned to... Wait, why did... I... What? what did I do? Oh, I just blocked, I guess. <laughs> When you start New Year Plus, if you unlocked it, if you understood correctly. Hmm. Oh, so that's not possible? Yeah, I don't know anything about summoning, uh, like, online summoning in this game. So I didn't know that was not possible. I, I, I didn't even think about it. Uh, closest New Game Plus completion for you is Bloodborne, but you have also never done New Game Plus yet. Did you- I did! I have made all my emotes myself. Thank you. The only one that I haven't made is the- the- the dumpy one. The- the- the, the twerking one. And the- the meme cats. But the foxes, all of the other foxes, those- those I have made. Yeah, some of them are just memes that are fillers or like they- they're placeholders for when I can make new ones. Um, because see, because I'm making them myself, it takes a little while and then I don't always have time to sit and draw. But I do have some more slots open. So I should actually be working on more emotes. And I am supposed to do an emote drawing stream as well, but I, I did say that, or ask if it was okay for people if I did it in the Discord instead. Because I feel kind of exposed to drawing on stream. <laughs> I don't know, I feel, I feel kind of awkward doing it, especially with a camera and everything. I don't know why. I just, mm. wait, hold on. I don't know why it got on torrent at all. You made that one, but mostly so you can spam it when people find the two fingers. <laughs> That's funny. Um, yeah, a lot of them are just placeholders, really. Um, the, the, the double ones, at least. The ones that look very similar. I really do need to make some more. But yeah, for those of you who have uh, any opinions or like... 
ideas of what type of emotes you would like, then uh, there is a... Oh, it's the, the sword that I'm using right now. <laughs> there is a suggestions channel in the Discord. So you can, you can uh, suggest stuff there if you want to. Ah, this bit. <laughs> Dual wielding time? I mean, we could do that. We could do that. Maybe that would be better. Wait. You think two tens went by? They did. But I'm I'm still using it a little while longer just because uh Just because I I r ran around so much on Torrent instead of actually doing combat. And I feel bad about the timer going without me actually doing anything. <laughs> uh, used to stream, so these days, since you don't stream anymore, you just have cursed emotes for shock value. <laughs> hey, that's fair. A lot of people do stream just so they can get affiliates, so they can have their own emotes and nothing else. I know plenty of people who have done that. Should we find the Albanoric woman? Latena. <laughs> uh, okay. And yeah, I guess some emos are also me. That 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 has been by by more by demand than anything else really. Because I feel awkward having emotes of myself. I feel kind of weird about it. But then, hey, if that's if people want it, then sure. <laughs> but yeah, I did a. Oh shit! I, I didn't I didn't see the the, the crab at all. <laughs> just I just <laughs> I just wanted the loot. I do have a loot emote, by the way, as well, which is uh, you know it's accurate because I I. I like loot. Um, di I did. I did draw the Astarian emote as well. I did. Um, but yeah. So my my sub goal that is like I have an actual other sub goal as well. Um, an actual sub goal as well. <laughs> that, that that sounded wrong. <laughs> Uh, like a general sub goal that is like combined with the ones that I do for the wheel spin. That is for uh, Ronnie cosplay because I have done that before on stream for Halloween, but it's a lot of work. So I'm planning on on doing that again if we reach the goal. Isn't this where the death right bird shows up? I actually never found that in my first playthrough. The first one that I saw was near Castle Soul in, in the mountaintop. Um, what software do you use to draw? I use a Clip Studio Paint. So it's like, it's not the best one, but I, I just... I wanted one that I only had to buy once and that I didn't have to subscribe to. There's one death bird in Weeping... Really? I have never found that one. I guess it depends on what time of day you come here as well. I think it o doesn't it only show up during the day. It absolutely is the best one. Is it? Clip Studio Paint. I haven't really tried that many. Um, but I, I, I think it works pretty well. There are night owls. Okay. Wait, doesn't Diallo show, show up near here? Lyurnia has always been very confusing to me. <laughs> it has always been a very confusing area to me. Uh, navigating and stuff.
Did you... Uh, going for... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I forgot about patches. That's actually true. I did forget about patches. I should probably fast travel over there then. I don't like that. You didn't see me. Okay. Oh, also the, the, the dragon will probably also be here. That's fine. Uh, Deathbird is north of where Patches is. Death right Bird is north of where Diallo shows up. Oh. I guess I fast traveled to the wrong one. <laughs> uh, I meant to... Well. Let's go here. Welcome to Finland, the land of Thousand Lakes. Mm -mm. Thank you, Toonie. Let's see. Yeah, we still haven't fought the dragon. I mean, it hasn't spawned yet. Wait! Is it these people who make those sounds? I've literally never noticed that before. <laughs> that may that makes me fight I feel kind of stupid, but I <laughs> just I never noticed before. <laughs> uh, seeing new players react to the dragon swooping in in Limgrave is among the peak of watching Elden Ring on Twitch. Yeah, that was that was a an unpleasant experience for me too. For sure. Dude, I never... I I don't... Maybe I've just never been here at night? Because I feel like I've never experienced this before. That they just... Because that is too loud to not have experienced before. <laughs> and then immediately getting TP to Celia Crystal Tunnel after finally defeating it. I did that before the dragon showed up here. Um, because I went here, this was where I went right after I started the first playthrough. Because I went south, so I just got rid of everyone here, opened the chest, got teleported to the, the tunnels there in, in Kaled, less than two hours into my first playthrough. So that was rough. Uh, I should do nighttime Elden Ring playthrough at this point. <laughs> you think the first really hard boss people meet is the Crucible Knight? Well, I mean, I guess that depends on how... Where, how you progress in the game. Because I tend to do things not in the in the intended order. Not intentionally, I just like exploring. The dogs are so annoying. missed the dragon in your first playthrough somehow. I mean, I don't know if the dragon will show up right now. 
So it hasn't shown up here either yet, but we'll see. I, I don't know what triggers it. Shouldn't you, like, early Caleb? Caleb, because you also like going the deepness early in all of it. I guess, I guess that's a fair point, Orion. Are you saying that's where you want me to go now? We could teleport. I was going to get patches. Uh, but I do tend to get distracted. Uh, but you're good. I'm glad. I am glad. I'm also doing pretty good. I know pretty good. I knew there wasn't... There was more. Mm, exploring got you to the twin gargoyles super early and also the twin virgin abductors. I remember you talking about the... 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 The, the twin virgin one. You were here when I did that. And I think you got a little bit salty because I, I killed them so easily because I got there so late. <laughs> um. <laughs> you don't mind if you want to go there, but really don't wish to be seeing Kaled. Mm. Could go to the tunnel to see Al Alexander, that's true. For those of you who don't know, I mentioned this yesterday. Um, I think a couple of weeks ago, I ordered the I pre-ordered the Alexander plushie, the official Alexander plushie. Let's see if the dragon will swoop down. Oh, there he is. Is on the left. Are you okay? Why are you trying to climb the mountain? Ow, what? What did I walk into before that? Because the fire hit me before it. Can you just come down? This is this is not fair. Dude, this is not fair. How am I supposed to Oh fuck. supposed to fight you while you're just up there okay I'm just gonna I'm just gonna run like right away so that it can actually move because that, <laughs> that's just this is not working for me <sighs> you struggled so long there was legit no way out but you finally managed it and Got to Altus Plateau. Mm. You don't actually remember? See, now he's just climbing down. Dude, can you- can you stop? Oh, I thought he would do the fire thing again. No. Stop it. I 
I don't like doing combat on Torrent. Can I make it? Oh, fuck. Stupid wing. Oh, I hate it. What did I just do? I wasn't sure if it was going to do the fire attack or... Uh just fly up and jump down. I'll catch up soon in, in with the chat. Ow, I was in the middle of a attack and attack. No! There we go. There we go. Ugh. <laughs> we did it. And because you didn't die to the Virgin at the bottom in the Raya Lucaria, so you had to not say anything how you got to the volcano and abductors. True. I do remember that. Mummy used even some in the small room boss fight in some of the ruins. Oh, Torrent. Yeah, I don't like using Torrent in combat because it just, it gives me... It's so difficult to dodge and I... Yeah, it's only it's only good when you're gonna close some distance, I guess. <sighs> oh, we're getting an ad starting soon. Well, People won't miss anything. It doesn't. It's okay if I play through the ads. <sighs> I really thought that I would die to the dragon for some reason, <laughs> but it wasn't that bad. I think it's just because I'm not used to this. Um, these weapons. So I just assume things will go worse than they actually do. You know? Uh, 
I think we're pretty far away. Yeah. With a new yun, uh, new yun, by the way, a new yun, <laughs> new run. <laughs> we really um, in combat mostly use torrent with the dragons to get close and some minor map enemies. You try to deal with more. Mm. I think it's for you. Also, some bosses are just too fast for you to even learn the move set, and then you don't know what to do. Mm. Yeah, I think for me the wait. It's kind of funny because I saw Sarah fighting, um... I saw him fighting the fire giant on his first playthrough, and I saw him using Torn, and like that... It never even occurred to me, even though... Even though it makes a lot of sense, because there's so much, uh... Like... Running around. Wait, I also heard something. Is it? Is this true? It doesn't matter if people say because it's not really actually a spoiler, but... With the Elden Beast now... Can you use Torrent there now? I heard some people say that, and I didn't know. Malekith, for you, you mimic ended up uh, chasing the run with the Rot Breath Dragon. Oh, um... Yeah, but that didn't have anything to do with Torrent, though. I think seeing more p other people fight him, you feel this time when you get to that, you might do a bit better. I think you will. Why does he keep running back and forth? <laughs> it's like, are you okay? <laughs> uh, I think you heard that it would be possible, but you're not sure. It would really help the fight, though. Yeah. But we would be one of the the we we had to experience it the, the hard way. No, just <laughs> no. Um Yeah, that was my main complaint about the Wait. Yeah, that was my main complaint about the the Elden Beast boss. This bossed, by the way, boss as well. That you had to. Uh... Had to run so much. Because you just ended up using a bunch of stamina. Running away. Or running away. Uh, run, running towards him. Or it. If Torn was available, you think it would have been more like how you did it with Radon because to this new run and with how you also were helping others with Radon, it's now easier for you to see dodge timings. Hmm. Yeah, if you could just observe sometimes, it might be easier too. But I guess you can do that with uh, a Mimic as well. You think you did use Torn fully for Radon? I did when I ran up to him, but I don't think I did while I was close to him. <laughs> Rods! <laughs> Walk him in! Walk him in! How was your stream? How was your stream? What did you do? What did you end up playing in the end? I mean, I saw one, but what did it, what did you end up doing for the rest of the stream? Um, long time no see. <laughs> uh, it was good. I'm glad. But how am I? I'm doing doing pretty good. I am. Um, well, we have. What are we done? We met Blythe. We uh, have gone to Lyurnia. We haven't really explored too much in Lyurnia, but we also did the... We progressed in Nefeli Luz quest. 
and um oh and i've died once today that was my first death in this playthrough so far so i have died and it was a stupid death as well it wasn't even gravity even gravity would have been less embarrassing um you ended up streaming pacific drive oh yeah i think you did that when i was um when i was there too so that's what you did the entire stream how did you like it though doesn't remember mm. one trolley death yeah yeah to be fair though i had just started using a new weapon as well because we did a wheel spin me but you know dad man how can you say that i am a giga player because i am not <laughs> i am definitely not uh you were surprised by what it was you didn't expect it but what was it then? Well, well, well. Thought you'd just help yourself to a man's personal belonging. Yeah, if you're gonna be like that. You scheming little thief. The gods demand repentance. Up your I ended up killing him in my first playthrough because I came here so late that he was dude, can you stop? I didn't have time to stop. Uh, when he, when he yielded, you know. Wait, wait, please. Yeah, it almost happened I again. <laughs> White flag and all. Sure, sure. Well, finally come round, have you? <laughs> I knew you would. You're a lady of reason. Sure. You and true. <laughs> hmm. Um, you don't remember the last time you played a game you didn't know a ton about? Yeah, but isn't it fun though? I actually like that now. Like, I, I prefer to not know anything about the game before I go into it, so I, I can get surprised. As long as you just look at the... You know, to see... Not reviews, but that you can see uh, ratings, you know, if it's a good game, like generally a good game. And then knowing little to nothing about the game itself. It's usually really nice. But also, guys, if you're not following Rods, go follow Rods right now. I forgot to say earlier. <laughs> I forgot to say, go follow Rods. He's a good friend of mine. Go do it, go do it. Uh, you really like that surprise? Hmm. Wait, you thought it was more a survival craft game and turned out to be much more story driven? Hmm. Well, that's good. It was a very pleasant feeling. You enjoyed it. That's good to hear. That is good to hear. Don't have to say that. Don't have to say that. But I did. Bean Boozle? Yeah. Yeah. can hold it in i'm not that old yet <laughs> yeah guys hold in your avocados it's important it is important ah well what do you know you're now how did i get i took you for a demi human or some such do i look like <laughs> a demi human i assure you sure well, water under the bridge now some things can't be forgiven <laughs> a true lady of reason just what I like. I'm patches, tarnished like only for Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. Honestly, frankly, so don't be. I'll be ready to. <laughs> don't forget to pop. Back. I'll be ready to. Okay. Yeah, that's it. We're gonna go back to Leerunia. Mm, you also missed the patches ambush in the new run before the the manor. Oh, do you lock yourself out of it before you get to the manor? No, I mean, if you go to the manor first. I mean, I know he appears there, but I, um... Wait, what was it that I was gonna do? Uh... Should we go and talk to Yura again? Because he... We haven't done that after we did the thing here. Can we with Raya? Yeah, I meant to do that. 
I meant to do that, but I, I just... Leonia is so confusing to me. <laughs> it's so confusing to me. Like, that's... I wanted to, to go and see her, but I... I guess I ran in the wrong direction, you know? But yeah, obviously rods. If you need to raid and run, do so if you if you if you want or need to, you know. Or you can hang out if you want to as well. Uh beautiful work. Felling that dragon. Oh as such. There's something you might like to know. The heart you brought back. It's used in dragon communion. If you should find yourself overcome by hunger for the heart. Yearning for its strength, then seek the decrepit church on the little oh, really done it. The western coast. You must not forget that those who partake in dragon communion will one day shed their humanity. Yeah, I did that with my faith dragon. build. Their yearning only worsens until the floodgates burst. Also, Unless that's what it looks like. The strength of a mighty dragon. Magnificent, but deadly. It's no surprise that dragon communion is ruinous. Are we talking about Latena? But yeah, but I, I want. I mean, I want to meet both of them. <laughs> you must not forget, though, those who partake their hunger until the flood of strand is no. I did. T I did talk about Latena. That is true. But I also want. When I ran around, I'd like. I was also looking for her. <laughs> But then there were a bunch of lobsters instead. Yeah, okay. Uh, Lyurnia. Let's, let's go to Lyurnia. There's a video that uncovered, uncovers all the NPC faces under the, under, under the helmets. I have not seen that. That's cool. That is cool. So is Latena, is she like, she's here, isn't she? Like around here? I'm cool, no, you're cool. It's very neat. Okay, let's. They also have tons of other stuff, like videos about Elden Ring and other Soulsborne games as well. You don't know the word. Um, you mean lore videos? Did you guys know Rods? He also does a few lore videos. Such a big brain giga memory. I do not. Not when it comes to this game. <laughs> Oh, we have this asshole here as well. Hidden stuff on like how or why they uh, things are. Yeah, isn't that lore as well? Not exactly lore videos, but some are kind of like adjacent to that. Mm. There's a, now also Elden Ring DLC videos, so you can't watch them. Mm. Failed lore videos. Ah, yeah, there you claim what? Rods just made a, a an Elden Ring lore video as well before well, like for for the D before the DLC like technical stuff yeah I know I know I'm I'm just messing with you <laughs> there is this one dog in Elden Ring that does so much damage one dog just one dog. They didn't seem right. I actually don't remember what he said. Aha. Your intuition oh! served you well. Oh! My doubts had been piling up. You the words of the truly, I believe, even worse. That's the part. Hmm. Oh, I have a gift. Yeah, this is how I got to, uh... A means for circumventing the Moog. door of the two... Give it a try. And if it drive high... In my first playthrough. I need to help though. No but thank you for the bits, Orion. 
I still haven't switched my weapons. I should probably... No, I can do this as well, and then I can switch. Almost died. <laughs> Could switch to two avocados. Could I? They must be a rare drop. <laughs> Could be only only you understand this joke, all right? <laughs> no one else understands this joke. I mean, maybe someone do, but I I they haven't said anything. Orion is making uh, inside jokes with themselves. But hey, that's okay. That is okay. Okay, let's switch back to my... my yush. My usual. Um, you need to get going because you need to get food going. Hope you all have an amazing night and stream for Vempolompomp. <laughs> thank you so much, Rods, for being here. And thank you so much for the raid as well. I hope you have good food. Wait, what are you having, by the way? But yeah, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Go follow Rods if you haven't. Oh, hi, Palm. How you doing, Palm? Story of your life? No. <laughs> right, you don't see that. I have sad news? What is the sad news? Hmm. I think Diallo should be around here somewhere? It really- oh yeah, it released the cheese. That's true. Well, it's a little bit easier to see here now because it's daytime. Hmm. Bread and s no, stop saying that, Rods, because now the olive oil is too expensive, so you buy 10% olive oil. The rest is so- No! Stop it, Rods. It's not funny. Do you remember got pizza yesterday? Pretty sure it- Hmm. Rods here is also lactose intolerant, by the way. He will know your pain. <laughs> I also don't know what that means. Most of the things that are being said in chat right now, I just, I, I, I'm not really sure if I understand half of it. Uh. Oh, this is where the the dragon is. Should we just do the dragon again? We can do another dragon. I literally did not see this dragon before I just picked up the loot because it looks like a log. Ah, fuck. Oh no, I, I ran the wrong way. It's fine. 
It's fine. Can you stop doing that? I'm trying to... Dragons are so annoying to fight. Oh, fuck. No! Uh, what? Yeah, this is... Dude, I'm true. That, that is just in my way now because I can do shit. I don't recall this happening that often in, in, like, my first time. Maybe I should just be on Torrent. Even though I hate fighting on Torrent. But he just does that so often now. Dude, can you stop? Holy crap. I'm surprised that I've been able to do any damage at all. It's just this is just terrible RNG. Not, not the stupid bug. Jesus Christ. Yeah, the lock-on is also not a lot of fun. Because uh, suddenly you just get locked on to a, a bug. Like, it's nice that you can lock on to different body parts of the dragon. But switching between them? That can be a pain. Holy crap, I'm... This is tiring. <laughs> uh, this, this is... It's not okay. Oh, holy crap. Wait, I'm actually surprised that I... I'm not gonna chase you anymore. You can come after me. Wait, that could hit me? Really? I thought the 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 the, the rock was in between. I would have healed if that wasn't the case. Okay. Okay. Well. That's the second death that we've had. <laughs> yeah, we did we did roll a gay blade. That's true. But I don't like fighting on torrents, even when there is a dragon. Oh, God damn it.
No! Oh wait, I actually did hit. I was in the middle of an attack, I couldn't dodge. Well, what was I supposed to do there? I'm in a, I'm in a nook here. time. What? Why can I not hit? you. That was very annoying. That was a very, very annoying boss <laughs> fight. <laughs> because I have... Uh, I don't recall having issues with that in my first playthrough. You actually think you should eat something now, but you don't really have a lot of options. Do you guys have the option to order? Well, I mean, it's pretty late now, though. It was a coronavirus or something. Uh, thank you for the GGs. That was. Yeah, I I don't recall that being such an issue. Before. I don't know. Not this time of day. Mm. Did the thing I did. And I even used the weapons that I'm comfortable with this time. I was supposed to go on this side. There's a grace over here as well. Jesus Christ, I forgot about you. <laughs> uh... I think every dragon you've beaten was on mount, just chipping away at the health. I mean, I have done that too. But the, it, it wasn't the, the, the writing that I meant. It was just the, the fire. It doesn't... It didn't do... I don't remember it doing... Like, flying away that often to breathe fire. I remember it being more balanced, whether it would just be st standing around and stomping around. And, uh... Wait. Yeah, I was looking for this grace. What's up, dog? <laughs> Ryan. <laughs> hmm. 
Let's see. What am I looking for? Sky actually up. I guess it depends. I think the entrance to where Latena is is supposed to be somewhere around here. Isn't it? Oh, this is also where the sh shack is. This looks like an opening. <laughs> um. I think it was along this, alongside this mountain. Maybe I'm just misremembering. I guess I am. Well, we can go to the shack, though. fight the Erdtree avatar while we're here. No, I, I'll, I'll just, I'll just look for it. I know it's alongside a, a mountain somewhere. Getting close to having enough to level up again. Yeah, the shack is up north. Ah, what? <laughs> uh, I feel like I'm so on edge today. I don't know what it is. When people raid or if there's like anything has just been startling me today. Just feel so on edge. <laughs> uh. There it is. God damn it. Wait, so it forces you off torrents when you go here? I didn't- I didn't un- uh, dismount at all. Oh yeah, it's because of- obviously. I don't really understand why he attacks me though, because I was helping him, you know? Dude, why do you not do the unsheath?
We got another Shabriri grape. I think that's the only reason why I found him. Was because I was looking for grapes. Uh, towards the end of my playthrough. I didn't find this place at all before then. I don't think. There were so many things in Lyurnia that I missed. When I first got there. Uh, that I went back for later on because... It's just so hard to navigate. There's so many things. I think he just went mad. He can also do some frenzy attack as well, and he drops the frenzy grape thing. Hmm. Yeah. We can go to this ever jail. I think that's where there's like a... Um, a giant of some sort. If I remember correctly. I'm not entirely sure though. You also found the new places now in the new run. A couple of ever jails you don't think you had seen? Oh. It was a troll. Ow. I keep forgetting the attack pattern, so I'm like just... I was just rolling around in circles there. I don't think I will be streaming for like too much longer now because I'm, I'm feeling kind of weird. Like kind of nauseous. I don't know what it is. It's like the game has almost given me a little bit of motion sickness in a way, but I don't know how because I usually don't get motion sickness from this game. <laughs> so I don't I don't know why. <laughs> Yeah, I remember this one. This one was really annoying. Did you get enough rest? I guess I kind of didn't. I kind of didn't. <laughs> like, I spent a long time in bed, but I didn't sleep as much as I, I should have. Because my neighbors were really annoying. So I guess that's part of part of the, the problem. That's why I was going going on a rant at the beginning. <laughs> I'm tired of having neighbors. Yeah, I was like, isn't this close to where the um I guess there is a, a cave here. I think it's right behind a gill or something. Yeah, I remember correctly. Yeah, I think that's what it is. I think that's what it is.
But damn, we died twice today. Also, this is not one of my favorites. I do think that I we went here on our um, seamless co-op run to to get the moss. I don't remember what it was for. What we were making it for. Ow. If you get wheel spin at the end, do you do the spin next stream? Uh, yeah, we can do it next stream. You just need to remind me if that happens. I mean, I'll, I'll probably re remember, but if I don't, then you need to remind me. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure that I would remember, though. being sneaky. They can't see me. But yeah, there was something that we used the moss for, but I don't remember what it was. Wait, what do you mean? But yeah, I also think that if, if the, the wheel spin were to happen, then it, it would probably also be more... It would probably be better to save it for next time anyway. To just start off the stream with a wheel spin. <laughs> uh... Kind of like what we did today. I mean, I did die, so... Uh... Maybe not, but... <laughs> maybe not. Oh, I've been here. The mossy nest. But I... Th there was something specific that we... We needed it to craft. Uh... We need to craft something. But I don't remember what it was. Hmm. Let us see. That was the cave I was looking for. Why do I always think that there is something there? <laughs> uh. Orion Wolfia uh, cheered. X333. No! <laughs> <laughs> You didn't have to do that. <laughs> Thank you so much. For the 333. Thank you, Ryan. You, you've been too kind. I hope... I hope you, you spend money on yourself this week instead. This coming week. He bonked me on the head. That's rude. Yeah, 
You're not bought new bits in a while. That's good. That is good. I know. I know. I know you're up there. That's the one I was looking for before. <laughs> you did pre-order the album and waiting on that. Mm. That is good, Ryan. I hope it arrives soon. Wait. That's interesting. I hope it arrives soon. I meant to go and check it out, the song, but I, I, I forgot. I even had it open on, like, I didn't have the song open, but I had, like, the front page uh, of YouTube open and it was suggested to me there, but I didn't, I didn't, I didn't remember to click on it. I hope it arrives in a day that you can go get it or in the, ne the next day. Mm. I hope so too. I hope so too. Ow. Dude, I was supposed to do the backstab. Can you not do the backstab? Nope, that was too, too... There we go. This one didn't do anything. Ow. Wait, no. There we go. Wait. That was a silly mistake. Doesn't this bring you up? Yeah. I do remember. I don't remember what's at the top, though. Mm. I miss buying albums. <laughs> I miss buying albums as well. The way out. Hmm. It's a whole ass person coming out of the, the his chest now. Yeah, that that is that is a way out. Uh, if you're, uh, you know, a xenomorph, for example, that is also a way out. Also, I do have Blasphemous too, like the second game. I will play that on stream at some point as well. I bought it on when it was on sale, like maybe a month or two ago, I think. It wasn't during Steam sale, it was on sale before that as well. Yeah, it was the first one. Totally Christian stream. I can't rem I can't believe you remember the c <laughs> I forgot that there was a a command for that. Damn, this is a long elevator ride. It didn't feel that long on the way up. You made that? Yeah, I know, but at the same time even if you didn't make it yourself, like, it, 
I'm surprised you remembered it too. <laughs> uh, you came back from the lurk. Welcome back, Palm. Welcome back. I can level up now. I did say I would do every other for health or no, I'm actually gonna put another one in. No. I did say I was gonna do every other one, and the last one I did was endurance. I'm gonna stop at health like with health at uh sixty though. Memory is so weird. It, it is really weird. <laughs> it is. It is. Let's see. I'm surprised you just stopped next to me here. Wait, I guess we could just place a marker here or something? Go to the, the front gate. Like, I know the direction to it, but at the same time... It's more difficult to ignore it when you see it on the on the... Right in front of you here. I get so easily distracted. I get so easily distracted, you know? Elden Ring DLC almost feels like a different game while still being the same game. Well, that's good, isn't it? it it's in a good way, right? I can't believe it sometimes. I'm looking forward to getting around to it eventually. But I'm also nervous about it. <laughs> Especially because I'm playing on New Game Plus. It's not in a negative way for sure. Mm. That is good. That is good. I think it's sad that the Albinorgs are uh, hostile towards you because I feel like we could be good friends, you know? I kind of like them. But it shouldn't affect it because it has its own scaling with the stuff. If you're on New Game Plus or New Game, Pl New Game or New Game Plus, uh, at least for what you have understood, because they didn't want people to just roll over the content with high-level characters. Hmm. Well, that's good. But I heard someone didn't Liz say that she had a friend who. Started on new game pl uh, plus six or something. And that it was really difficult. <laughs> that, I don't know, maybe... I don't know. But yeah, I guess that, that that's good. I'm a little bit sad that they don't have achievements for the DLC, though. Um, 
it's really difficult and you're on your game around level 160. It gets easier when you get the items to level up, but it's still tough. I think this is where I'm gonna wrap up though. I'm I'm just I'm not feeling very good. I don't know why, but I just don't. I guess I just need a little bit less time in front of my PC. <sighs> but I was also not feeling like the best from the beginning either. Like I wasn't feeling bad, but I was Feeling kind of weird. Oh! <laughs> right. <laughs> this is for the bit thing, not you. Wait, this is. <laughs> this is for the bit thing, not me. <laughs> oh! Oh! <sighs> Orion. God damn it. Well, thank you so much, Orion. You, you're very sweet. You're very kind. And I appreciate it. Like, it's not because you're empty. <laughs> uh, hold on. Hmm. But thank you either way, Ryan. I appreciate it. You're too, you're too kind. You're too kind. Um, wheel spin. Mm. So do you want me to do the wheel spin now so you see what the weapon is? Or should we wait? No, we can wait. We can wait. It's it's more interesting if we wait. Right? Yeah. So we have a wheel spin that we will do uh, next time. Well, I mean, next time I will be streaming in Stars and Time, which is on Tuesday. But then next time I'll be playing Elden Ring, which will be on Wednesday. Think you should do it next stream? Mm. I think so too. I think so too. But yeah, it's been good though. And all, all, even even though I'm ending a little bit earlier than I usually do, four hours isn't a short stream, you know? It's just short compared to what I usually do. But that doesn't mean that it's, it's short overall. And we have still been able to do quite a bit of stuff, you know? We, we, we've done things. Died twice as well. But I have also said that after I was done with- Well, I mean, I have said that I also should work on not having such long streams as well, because it's not really that healthy, you know? So overall, I think it's a good thing to, to end now. Um... Because sometimes I can I can kind of forget that I'm that I'm playing for as long as I am, you know. You forget the time it just flies. It was a nice stream. I'm glad. I'm glad. Thank you for stream. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much for being here, silly bee. I appreciate you being here as well, and welcome in again. Um. I'm sorry that my energy has also been a little bit lower, uh, like towards the end now, but yeah, I don't know. It's been, it's been, it's been a, it's been a strange week, <laughs> but I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend though. Rest of your weekend. We're going to see if anyone oh! is on. <laughs> oh! <laughs> All right. I have to apologize for that. Well, I just... I just do. <laughs> I just do. Here's a minion fighting a banana dragon. A minion fighting a banana dragon. <laughs> a banana dragon. That's kind of funny. I, li I like the banana dragon. But yeah, so what I mentioned yesterday is that we're gonna we're gonna reset the timer here. Um every no timer. Um the goals for bits and subs, not the Ronnie cosplay, that will stay until we reach the goal. So you don't have to worry about that one. But the, the bits and subs for the the wheel spin, I will reset that every 
Saturday, like at the end of the stream, so that there will be a new. You know, we will we will reset it so it's starting fresh. Uh, for next week. So, it will be set to zero again on Wednesday. It's because I stream in Stars and Time on Tuesday as well, so it's like... It's just to keep it a little bit easier, you know? But yeah. Let's see if we can find someone to raid, though. You know... I think we can raid Toonie. Toonie has also been hanging around a bit as well, which is also really nice. So I, I think it's a, I think it's a nice thing to to uh, to bring some people over to him as well. You know, he's good people. He's good people. You're starting our time. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! But yeah, thank you guys so much for being here. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna raid Toonie. Toonie Boons. He's playing, um, Super Mario World. Yeah, Toonie, he plays a lot of, uh, retro games and Nintendo games, and... He sometimes plays some Metroidvanias as well, which you know that I enjoy, too. So, let's give him a, give him a, a, a sneaky little raid. Mm -mm -mm. I need to scroll and find find a stream. There it is. There it is. Yeah, let's do it. But thank you guys so much for being here. I have I've had a really good time so far with this this playthrough. It's been a lot of fun. And uh, thank you guys so much for for letting me do it as well because you know i couldn't i couldn't really do it without you guys <laughs> and um and we will continue on wednesday and then on tuesday we'll be playing in stars in time and if you have not seen the other parts and you want to see them you can watch watch them on youtube the first part is up the second part should be up as well uh either later today or tomorrow like it's it's kind of uploaded already, but I, I need to do some extra things before I pub publish it. So yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your weekend. I'll see you on Tuesday. Take good care of yourselves. You're the best. Don't forget that. You're the best. 